Yeah. Oh, yeah. He said that they were locked in 50 minutes and counting to shoot off their nuclear wall. Yay! We would be getting it back in an hour. Merch store? I mean, he meant the world war. Nuclear war! Nuclear war. Merch store and uh, Star Wars? Yes. Dudes, this is going to be a hell of a stream. This is going to be a hell of a stream here. It's going to be good. Oh, yeah. It's going to be awesome. I'm ready, dude. I'm ready. Yeah, it should be in the title. It should be in the title. Isn't it? I think it is. It's all updated. It should be good to go. I don't even know if title. I don't know if title is a is a is a command. I don't think it is. So this shirt is available in hoodies, uh, regular sweatshirts, pullover hoodies, um, t-shirts, the lots. It's it's up, baby. It's up. Oh, it's gonna be great. It's going to be great. I'm not going to waste too much of your guys' time here. Okay? Is that a crew neck sweatshirt? Oh, fuck me in the ass. <laughs> yes! Uh, I'm not going to waste much of your time. I, I we're, we're here to play some, uh, some Star Wars. I did... This is the first time I... Or this is the first time in like a couple of years. This is like the... I haven't pre-ordered in, in a couple of years. But I got a poster with it. And I got some sort of a skin pack that gives me like an orange lightsaber, stuff like that. That's pretty cool. It's pretty neato. I got it on PS4. I know there's going to be a lot of trolls coming in here saying like, why didn't you get it on PC because you don't get it in 60 frames a second? Guess what? EA doesn't have that great of a track record for me on PC. I would like to be able to play the game without having to to fix it and and go to fucking forums constantly trying to figure out why the, why the fuck my game is crashing. So, we're going to be playing it on PS4. <clears throat> that's that's the end of it. Mogar, what's up? What's going on? I guess this is just one of the, it's it's one of the perks. It's one of the perks of living in in Australia uh getting the game uh, that much earlier, which is nice. <sighs> but the PC, dude, got any merch coming uh, yet, my dude? Just kept fading. It just launched about five minutes ago. We just launched uh, the merch store about five minutes ago. We're starting the merch store off with the Mean Street shirt, and then we're going to be slowly putting more on the store. So right now, the Mean Street shirt is available in long sleeve, like baseball tees. Or not tees, but long sleeve baseball shirts, uh, t-shirts, uh, hoodies, the lots, and they're pretty badass. They're pretty nice, and I really want to get a, a notification thing set up. I'm not sure how to do it, um, but I want to get that thing set up as well. Badass on a hoodie, hell yeah, dude! This is the shirt. This is it. Oh yeah, burgers. <clears throat> and truth be told, we still have, we still have uh, the very end of Death Stranding to do. But today we we have this game early because we're in Australia, so we're gonna be playing this all day, all damn day. That tomorrow sounds good. <laughs> I've got I've, I have to end the stream until you're finished. <laughs> Ending it. <clears throat> um, but yeah. Contact Streamlabs directly. Check the basics and couldn't find anything. Yeah, indeed. Well, before before when I had a, a notifier for shirts with, uh, um, you know, with with uh, uh, Teespring, I had to get it like custom made. I had to get that alert program custom made. 
Uh, the new shirt is not, is is it's not for a limited time. Um, it's just it's just uh, I I I believe it's going to be on the 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 store from now on. But we're launching the the store with just this shirt right now. Try to get some hype going for the shirt. Um, but yeah, so I mean, you can get one now or you can get one later. Probably, it's really no rush. I know for certain that the shirts are fantastic quality because uh, I had them send me some samples of their store and they're fantastic. The shirts are, are great. T-shirts are amazing. Anyway, guys, without further ado, why don't we get this thing started? Because um, we have this we have this game early, so why don't we just whip start our journey to become a Jedi? Yep. Re up your Mean Streets game. I'm going to do the same thing, dudes. I'm about to do the same damn thing. I'm about to start a new. What the frig? I guess we'll we'll do we'll do Jedi Master. I'm not a Jedi. I'm not really a Jedi Grandmaster. I thought this was a, meant to be like a game where you're becoming a Jedi. I'm not a Jedi yet. Parry timing. Look at that. Incoming damage. Good lord. Players who are familiar with melee action uh, games and desire a challenge. The site says available for 14 days, though. For this campaign, yes. For the for the campaign that's 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 happening right now, um, I guess that it, it we're gonna be putting it on later later. Uh, I'll have to get, I'll have to I'll I'll have to uh, is to to suss out the 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 specifics of of the campaign, but. It is going to be a permanent fixture eventually, but right now, I guess it is a limited thing. So we have 14 days. Um, but yeah, that's 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 how she, that's the, the the way she goes, I guess. I really don't know much about the the campaign because I went out and got this game. He contacted me, he was like, "Are you ready to launch?" I'm like, "Just do it." I have a Star Wars game to play. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, them guns. Yeah, <laughs> I know. I need. I, I'm about to bust out of this thing. Oh, <sighs> fairly standard to go to campaign. Yeah, so I'm not really sure when it's going to be coming uh, onto the store. It's going to be on the store as a permanent fixture, but it, it's campaigning for 14 days. Just order your tea. Nice. Just kept fading. That is so awesome, dude. Yeah, don't be shy. I don't have an alert for it, so let me know. You guys gotta let me know when you, um, you know, order one of those. Such a rhythm, Cal, but the boss wants a word. He'll be good for us. Here he is, Chief. An error has been detected on line 10A. All our clamps are jammed. I need two workers to climb up and secure the cables. That's not an easy maneuver. The Cal will double your pay for this shift. Come on, Cal. Well, it's a score. That couldn't hurt. Huh? Eh, hey, hey. eh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Get to work. Let's giddy up, Buttercup. Wait, no Co no no 15 minute right Kojima video. Da -da 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 -da. Did you miss Oh! I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Did you miss much? No. No, you didn't. <laughs> We're fine. <laughs> Blazing, what's going on, man? How are you? Sorry, Cal. Sorry about it. I don't think these 
tools are gonna make it through the ship. Holy shit, that. <laughs> I'm I've, here. I've got the subtitle size, like, super After huge. You, so, I might need to turn it down a bit. <laughs> Super thick. Well, you look at that. A separatist ship. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. All right, let's go. You can change the text size. That's amazing. Yeah, you can. It there. It goes from one to fifteen. I've got it on fifteen right now. So maybe what we should do? <laughs> maybe we should. Maybe we should. Uh, uh, film grain, motion blur, gameplay, subtitle scale. Let's go ahead and turn it down to ten because that is that is pretty massive, dude. It's fucking huge. Letterbox opacity. Okay. <laughs> Jump. Hey, you okay? Hey, yeah, what? I'm good. Ladder's out, though. You're gonna have to find another way. We're gonna hey, find no problem. Another way. I'll improvise. I've See got, you there, pal. I've got a freaking improvise here. Okay. Yeah! It's good size, nice. Depart this barge immediately. You are not approved. Trash. DHG. Trash. Just not Thank you for giving that sub over to Misfit Druids. Thank you so very much. <laughs> Thank you so much, dude. <laughs> Dun, 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 Easy there. Just passing through. Just passing through, old man. Oh, I see. <laughs> You're gonna have to find a way around, kid. You gotta do the tutorial. I can just about taste the credits. It's gonna be a wild night tonight. Let's get this job done. Yipes. <laughs> Thank you, BHG. Thanks, man. Good to see you. You too. Get yourself killed. That's the idea. It's basically the tutorial, kid. Dude, I love Star Wars. I don't care. I really don't care if this game if this if this game sucks in every way possible. Like I'm still gonna love it because it's Star Wars. Maybe. I think. Just passing through, guys. No need to come out and say hi this time. Don't go to don't don't go. I have not seen The Mandalorian, no, because I don't know if we have Disney Plus here. Sounds good. In Australia. But it'll be there freaking sued. Super sued. Oh shit! Wow, I forgot the button. Okay. Whoa. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it comes out next week. Okay, nice. How'd you get here? How'd you get here? Hey, what the heck? Huh? Oh, who? What? Did you have to do a flip? Ouch. This, this seems very dangerous, though. It seems extremely dangerous. Oh, nice. Kingdom of Rot. Very good. Good looking out, kid. Hey, kid! That's pretty nice. That looks pretty good. Hurry, we gotta finish 
before they start cutting this wing. I pr I'm pretty sure. We just put up like one hand railing. Cal, use the manual override lever below. Should you pre order the deluxe or now or no? I have no idea. We just started. I don't know. Oh, pull. Got it. Your turn. Ugh. Hold on. All right. Clamp secured. This is very dangerous. Whoa. You okay? Still here. Ugh. Give me a fright there, pal. Done. Hang on. The I Ultra Mega Star Lord version, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> we're done. Get out up here. Come take a look at this. Check it's this out. Jedi fighter. What a score. It's a real scrapper's payday. I mean, this thing's been here, what, four years? Five. <laughs> Never flew this, but down on a place of glory. Those Jedi. A real tragedy. I've always said they couldn't all be traitors. Yeah, maybe. Uh, this is just our lucky day. Empire's gonna get a lot of good material out of it. Yeah, here we are, scrapping these ships from the war, just so they can turn around and make new ones. What a racket, huh? All of us risking our necks for the bosses. And the pay was better back during the Republic, too. Hey, you really should watch what you say. Well, listen to me. Find us free like this? It'll be your ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you're a young guy. You don't end up like me. <laughs> Eventually, you gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. <clears throat> Whatever you say. Hey, we should get back down. Whatever you, you say, Star Wars to... monster. What is that? Jesus, wait! My camera! Whoa! Super sliding, dude. Do it, do a trick. Do a sick jump. Whoa, whoa. Bro, you okay? Cal! I, I can't climb up! Bro, just hang on! I'm slipping! No, don't let go. I, I can't hold on! Bro, no! Whoa, I'm back. Are you okay, bro? Whoopsie. I, I'm all right. Just pin down. Pilot's gun. I'll get us out of here. Just hang on. Watch out, Cal. Look out. I got a regular copy because I live in Australia. You all right? Yeah. Okay, we gotta. We gotta move. Come on. What it, happened? What was that back there? It's the 15th in Australia. Wait, that, that was the force, wasn't it? Just forget what you saw, okay? Please no, trust me. I've seen them. I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. Bro, the bounties out on people I like know. you. I know. Kiss me, you Star Wars monster. Yeah, we're ready. We need to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. In a world where all of your friends are Star Wars monsters. Yeah. 
Kel. I've been working with you some time now. I've never seen you do anything like that before. <laughs> We've been through some hell together. <laughs> what up, Cabby? So, I know the risk that you took for me. I just, I don't know how to repay you. Don't mention it. I mean it. What up, Wayne? You don't have to worry about me. This place is not safe. Maybe you should, you know, disappear. Just gotta head back to my place, grab my bag. Tappers owes me a favor. Well, I heard he was up on uh, <laughs> Mount Shadow. Yeah. You won't be seeing me for a while, prof. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, Kel. Uh, Sarah isn't at work yet. She's going pretty soon. Whoa, is our friend Chris Angel? <laughs> the Star Wars monster version of Chris Angel. He's mind freaking me right now. He's got mind freaked, bro. Excuse me, excuse me. Sorry about that. Sorry. Off. What's up, Scotsman? Prof, wait up. Hey, hey wait up. Hey, what the heck? <clears throat> Let's go ahead and give it one more try. What the? R2? You rascal. <laughs> Now that's a proper spaceship alarm right there. Apprentice, mark well and listen. Master. Trust only in the force. Trust only in the horse? Train has stopped. Yeah, something's going on. Everybody up. Identification ready. <clears throat> Nobody try to run because we're a gr we're great shots. Move out and line up. Probably just another contraband inspection. <laughs> Scott's I hope you feel better, Scott's There they are! Blast! Is this all of them? Yes, second sister. We seek a dangerous fugitive. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. Turn yourself in. Or everyone present shall face summary execution. Well, summary sounds nice. 
I think it's time someone came forward. I, uh, I had been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. We refit and rebuilt ships. Or a wintry Best execution. The then came the Empire. <laughs> and engineers became scrappers. This is supposed to take place right after episode the workers, three. I just started getting worked. Oh. We all know the truth. We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire. We're all just expendable. Yes. You all. No! Star Wars monster! Look at this. A lightsaber. I found the Jedi! Noob. What's that? Who's that? Out the disturbance. Oh, that hurts. Hold it. Go move. Wait. I'm, How do you get I'm an excellent shot. Easy now. Got a stole. Found you, Motherfuck intruder. you! <laughs> I hope you had families, and I hope they miss you very much. Oh! I'm a Jedi. I'm from a professional. A traitor! Blast them! Just buy them! I can't help. Ow! Like I need backup. Whoa! Turn around, dude. Oh, did I? Okay. Just before the... Okay. Send it back. Send it back. Send it back. Ow! Right. Okay. Oh, wow. I've taken some serious damage already. I'm taking some serial damage, dude. Remember the tutorial. <laughs> He's turned off his tutorial system. Woo! Gotta keep moving. I chose to rest instead. That's how I prepare. <laughs> That's how you prepare for death. Right. Rest when you're dead, stormtrooper. Fuck up. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> blocking lightsabers, dude. No way. No freaking way. Hey. We have the. This more tutorial. Okay. Get back. Hit the spawning hole. We'll go down to the spawning hole. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Just before an enemy attack. Gotcha. Force powers deplete the force meter. On objects with a blue outline. Okay. Oh, I see. That's the blue outline. say use the r1 I'm doing the r1 
Oh, you just lock it in. You don't hold it down? Okay. Use the force! Use the horse! Oh, that's pretty badass. Hold on a second. <laughs> I, I, must have, I must have missed that somewhere. Controls. Push. Okay, so R2? R2! Must be R2. Oh, you hold R2 and then hit R1. Is that it? Oh, I get. Oh, okay. I guess. I guess we don't rip it off. We just. We just want to climb it. Ah, I see. Well, that's not nearly as exciting. attack Cut those cables. Got it. Climb around. Yeah, I guess so. I was hoping for some sort of like super jump, you know, like a Skywalker jump. The ones that look like super awkward, where you just fly into into, into oblivion. Probably gonna die here. Oh. We got a Jedi down here. We got a Jedi down. Respawn, respawn. We are playing on hard mode, so it is, it is, they do hit pretty hard. <clears throat> Plus, I'm supposed to be becoming a Jedi, I thought. I didn't know I was already su uh, supposed to be a Jedi. I'm not, I don't think I'm very good at being a Jedi. We did go, th we did go through the tutorial. To become a Jedi, you must first go through the tutorial. No! Stuff like collectibles or something. Get to the front. Stop the train. There he is. Blast him. Oh no! Need cover. Got to move in between bursts. Now. Don't tell me when to go. Well, I got this for PS4 because I wasn't about to trust uh, <laughs> EA on PC. Faster! Here, I'm ready for your trick. Deutsch! He shot the coupling out. I shot the cup. He shot the coupling out. Okay. Gotta get down. Ah! Ah! 
Am I running higher frame rate mode? Is that a thing? Oh, well, I don't have my PS4 Pro. I'm not going to get it until I get all my shit in. Well, I don't have my back. stuff in yet. Only way is up. Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba that was lucky. No, my stuff still isn't in, and they sent me an email saying that I, I, I have to pay, like, an outrageous amount for customs clearance now. Oh, my God. It never ends, dude. They're just bleeding me dry. It's so fucked up, man. They, they have all my stuff. They can do whatever they want. We'll pick you up when we can. They're basically holding all of my possessions, like, for ransom. Hold on, I have to zip up my... my wife. Zipped up, baby. I gotta zip her up. Cool. Cool. You like the poster? Yeah. Not too shabby, huh? Cool. Good quality. Mm-hmm. Cool. Finally, something cool came out of pre-ordering. You going to work, babe? Yeah. Okay. See, I, I zip her up all the time. Whenever, whenever I ask her to zip me up, she gets weirded out. She's going to work soon. <laughs> it's a double standard, yeah. Hey! Damn it. Get him! You can't beat us. You can't beat us. Gink, 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 gink. Try it, dude. Fucking try it, bro. What now? Red Dwarf. Thank you so very, very much. For the 58 months, dude. I do appreciate that, man. How the hell are you? Thanks, my brother. I'm going to go ahead and... We're going to get this this uh, music down and the effects down. Amount to 85. Dialogue needs to stay up. Because it is, it is pretty overpowering, I think, for the... There we go. What time is it right now? It's 10.51 in the a.m. Shaky Steve, yeah. Oh! I went and picked this up at 9 a.m. This can't be good. Whoa! This can't be good, for Pete's sakes. Hey! <laughs> Hold on! No! Um. Jesus! You should not have come back. Going somewhere. Oh, 
I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who was your master? Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? I took an online course. What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? I don't have a master. I took an online course. <laughs> Whoa. Shite. Quickly recover, quickly recover. Oh! Better than I thought. I'm almost dead. It was DeVry Jedi University. Yeah, because that's going to work. Star Wars monster, get us out of here. Thing off and grab some seat. I'm, I'm a Star Wars monster pilot. Just say good. Just take good. Good. Sit down. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Seer Junda, and this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the Manus is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal, Kestis. Who was that back there? Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Braca. So we made our move. Is this the girl from yeah. Mad TV? Well, it's the bounty on Jedi these days anyway. That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. Wow. You too? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? Quiet, monster. Jedi Council? Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. She's a force user. She went to rehab, but she relaxed. Calicam! You were talking in your sleep. Weirdo. Weirdo? Who's who's the one watching somebody else sleep? You don't even know me, the uh, pilot Star Wars monster.
I was just smelling your hair for about an hour, and you were talking in your sleep, you weird piece of shit. Why don't you just grab some seat? I'm a Star Wars monster. Grease? Not now. I got work to do. Grease? Yeah. Interact with what? Oh, some chess? Stars. Oh. Hey, uh, could you not do that? <laughs> Sorry. That song. I wrote it. Years ago. No, you didn't. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. That was a Hoobastank song. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Well, not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No, but I knew your master, Jaro Tapal. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen, something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. It's out of control. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. You can't hide those Boucher in the eyes. Jedi I knew discovered it before the purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? No. I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. What's up, Mon? But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. It's not gonna be another Star Wars monster, is it? It's good to see you, Mod. May the horse be with you. Oh, I guess I'm looking for a Jedi then. Yeah, I guess if so. there's already one here, why does Seer need me? Mother flipping skill points, dude. Basic attack. Customization. Poncho. The scrapper? Poncho. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at that, look at that. Okay, got the poncho on. Very good, very good, very good. Mantis. That's that's premium content right there. <clears throat> EA Sports. It's in the Star Wars monster. Okay. Does this does the middle thing do anything? Oh, it makes a sound. The mid the middle touchpad. 
With original soundtrack by Danny Elfman. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Yeah, we Just should probably need to focus my mind. We should probably meditate. We should probably contact our false gods. Save points are located throughout Cal's journey. Make sure to interact with them. Save your progress. Okay. Save points are where Cal can rest and spend skill points. Oh. Oh my god. You have enough skill points to learn new skills. Oh, wow. Wow. <clears throat> Unlocks a powerful strike that is deadly against weaker enemies. I guess that we just have to do this one. Oh, frick yeah. That was a weak enemy. <laughs> Die, weaker enemy! Okay. Maximum force is increased. Perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. Dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. His maximum life is increased. Holding slow allows Cal to slow his target for a longer duration. Perform a quick kick attack. Attacking out of a sprint. Perform a special lightsaber attack. Defense are improved, allowing him to take less stamina damage from incoming attacks. It's fantastic. Okay. Oh, enemies have respawned. Dark Souls much? <laughs> Let's get out of here. It, were, it looks like it's worth a thousand dollars. Hey, BD1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. I speak robot. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait. Hold on! You little rascal! Did you just slice that? Thanks. Hey, thanks a lot, bud. Hey, are you single? What's what's your deal? Look for a man about a horse. <laughs> That's the vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. I do see it now. Wow, I really see it. <laughs> okay, hold on a second, hold on. So, we're here. This thing's over here. <laughs> I better check the map. Try experimenting with the hollow map controls. Zoom out, zoom out, okay. Mm hmm hmm. It seems like it checks out. <laughs> I don't want to exper experiment anymore. Great. That's fantastic. Also shows unexplored pathways and important landmarks. That's an unexplored path over there. Oh my god. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Wow. Right. Okay. Can't jump across that. We need some sort of mega jump. We need some kind of mega jump. Ugh. Die! Whoa, my friend. Over here. Do what? Oh, there must, there's something over here. Is that what? You there? A really big bug. Fuck you! Ow! That looks pretty badass. That looks pretty cool. And what about the what about collectibles? Oh, that's you can't grab onto that. Die, monster! Ow! What's the overhead slash? Zoink. Okay. It was after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. 
uh, dead splocks. A dead splocks killed by boglings when it attempted to raid their nest. Through a rare ability known as psycho psych psychometry, Cal can receive information from the force when he touches certain items. Oh, okay. That's pretty rare. No way through here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. I guess so. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. <laughs> Every goddamn droid is a comedian. R2, you rascal! <laughs> what the? Oh, R2! <laughs> Ugh. That thing away, dude. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. What do you think, buddy? This way to more tutorial. Is it fine? How'd you know that would work? Oh, it's just another meditation. <clears throat> Great. R2, you son of a bitch. R2, what's that? You slept with my wife? You son of a gun. R2, I gotta watch you, buddy. You rascal. You got staring, rascal. That's not opening. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> I hear you. But there's something over here I want to explore. There might be some sort of freaking loot over here, so just wait, just hold on a second. Yeah. Looks like there's some kind of thing over here for Pete's sakes. <laughs> Illuminates. Oh, sick, dude. Doesn't make the. It's not the best. It's a great weapon, not a great flashlight. That's the thing. Yeah. That thing looks like it smells worse than grease does. Oh man! Oh. oh yeah. What the hell? Whoa! Yeah, it's a super monster. Oh God. Jesus God! Wow. Okay. Maybe we should maybe we should just just destroy this guy. <laughs> when you when you die, you lose all your experience. <laughs> Damage the enemy you killed, you will restore your lost experience. Oh man, it's got a whole bloodborne thing going here. My precious experience. I wonder if we should, wonder if we should try to kill this guy. You should not have come back. You son of a gun, Michael. Good to see you, brother. Thank you for twenty nine months. If you guys don't know Michael Lepuyare, Lepois. As he, as his friends call him, or as I call him, uh, dude, go follow this guy out. Death count one. That's death count two, dude. I just, I fell off the train earlier. I think I, I was just, I was just reminiscing in my mind about something R two said that was hilarious, and I fell. I was like, "Whoa, man! What did he say? I was so funny." <clears throat> it was something like beep boop beep boop boop. Man, that was so funny. R2. The stormtroopers beat me down too. That's true, Chucklefuck. So I actually died 400 times already. This is the beginning of the game, yeah. yeah. It's, got some, it's got some loading. I'm guessing the PC version, is, is it loads qu quite quickly. <clears throat> How do you get experience back? It looks like it's got kind of a Bloodborne thing going on where the enemy that kills you keeps uh, your experience until you kill that son of a, son of a bitch. So you kill that son of a bitch. I guess we should we should at least give him another try. This guy's pretty tough. I like how they have a a, a, a pretty pretty tough boss at the at the very beginning. You're stoked to fuck this game in the butt, nice dude. Dude, I love butt stuff. Any kind, really. I love it. It's so weird and awesome. Yeah. 
<laughs> it's just so weird and awesome. No! What the frip? No! Just get the thing. Echo, pod, do the thing. No! Boggling was killed. Life essence. Now get the to fuck out. Go! Super roll. Super roll. Secret discovered. Okay, we'll come back for that guy. That guy's gonna kick our ass. Illuminate. Go! We'll come back for that guy. I really don't want to spend my first two hours in this game just trying to fight some, some giant frog. The uh, Honey Boo Boo's mother trying to battle Honey Boo Boo's mom for like two hours. And it's not what I want out of my playthrough here. Whoa. What difficulty we're playing on hard mode? Are you right above it? Can you just drop down onto it or is this going to kill you dead? Okay. What is this place? What the heck? Honey Boo Boo's mom is a saint! I guess we gotta go get that thing too, huh? What the heck is that? What the? Okay, you're gonna get chopped up, dude. Okay, do I grab onto it like this, maybe? No, we do not. Okay, we can't really do that. I think we're gonna have to walk across. Jedi used this place to study the sphere above. I can still feel the excitement. I get, I'm getting a boner. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm getting so freaking excited right now. Oh my god. So, what the heck? I wonder if... We probably have to get to it on the... Oh, no, we can just do this. That's right. That's what's going on. Okay. You should not have come back. Oh! Right. <laughs> I guess that's not what's going on. My father is back in here. 59 months. Dad, thank you so much. Papa. Thank you so very much, Dad. I'm able to get over there. What about climbing up onto this? Oh, I guess that's just how we get up back on top of this thing. I think we have to go around for this or something. Can you... Yush! There it is. You want to get up there. You should not come back. Ooh, spam fish! Oh my god. <laughs> Already better than the last Jedi. <laughs> Most impressive. Spam fish. I love you, buddy. I miss you, man. It is, it's wonderful to see you, dudes. Thank you for tuning in today. I'm not sure if we're able to get, actually get over there, right? Like maybe, maybe we can. I don't think we can jump over there. How long should the game be? Twenty hours? I don't know. I, I I don't know how long this game should be. I guess it's not really up to me to make that decision. It does have a thing on it, but I'm kind. I'm, I think we have to go from the other side. I think we might have to like. I might have to go from the other side. Let me just go check. Let's meditate. Let's let's go ahead and meditate on this. This looks pretty goddamn dangerous. That's a, that looks pretty dangerous. There's also a thing down there. But uh, this game has apparently this game has it, it kind of has a tendency to fool you with the ledges. There's a lot of ledges that you can grab onto, but there's more ledges that you cannot grab onto. I don't think we can just run over and grab on those ledges. It's probably two and a, two and a half million, I'd say. Two and a half million hours. What about this thing? Is this thing going to electrocute me if I... Yeah. <laughs> not a very good little climber. 
when I saw this guy, I was like, this guy's probably an excellent climber. He's probably a good little climber. He doesn't really climb on a lot of stuff. I don't think we can get from this side either. Yes, sir! Okay. I am convinced that it is that, that we cannot uh, get in here yet. You gotta leave some stuff for later at the beginning. We're obviously where we're coming back for that giant monster that's super hard right now, so we'll probably come back for this too. Oh. Okay, let's go ahead and... Since we're coming back anyway... We're coming back anyway, so I'm not too scared. I'm not too worried about it. It's been restored. Very good. I'd like to move it along. Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. Careful! Careful! Just like back at the scrapyard. I used to bullseye womp rats and weren't any bigger than that. Hold on, everyone. I'm coming. I'm just watching right now, but I'm coming later. Weak ass enemy. I learned this in the in the tutorials. I learned that in the tutorials. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Did we really need to be a Jedi to know that? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I'm, get, I'm thinking this <laughs> psychometry thing is, is, is just a big, it's, it's a big hoax. <laughs> Apparently this small round hole inside of this room was used for pooping. That was pretty brave. You okay? What's up, listen? Wait, it's pretty good so far. I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, call Miss Cleo for your free reading. Try the coconut mm. shrimp. It's a taste well, of the island. The scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Okay, try that. Try one of those. The vault. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay. Beep oh. trill? I'm pretty sure that's a racial gotta slur. Out a way out of this place. My droid is rusty, but I'm pretty sure he just said the N-word. Customized lightsaber, here we go. <clears throat> Hey, look at this, the premium content. Premium! <laughs> she needs premium, dude. Premium! <laughs> wow, it's so, it looks so uh, different. <laughs> I guess, I don't know. We're going orange, it's the premium content, bruh. Switch? Not have come back. Oh yeah. Rupinder Paul, thank you so very much for coming on back. The eight months. Do appreciate that, my friends. Look at this premium, sweet, sweet premium content, dude. That is so premium. Oh my god, you look at the button, dude! <clears throat> We're gonna walk into the cantina and it's gonna be like dur, 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 dur. Hold the music. Is that premium content I see? Hit it! <laughs> Yeah. <clears throat> this guy's got some premium content, dude. Uh, yeah, it was it was for pre-ordering. I I own I never pre-order stuff. Not that I'm above it or anything. I just never think of to pre-order. But I pre-ordered it from uh, JB Hi-Fi here in Australia because if you get it within the first couple of days, it's fifty nine dollars instead of seventy five, <laughs> which normally Australian. Uh, Games that you buy in Australia are 75 US. So, it was a normal price. Uh, BD, that's a little small for me. Don't worry, I'll find my own way out. 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You actually get, you actually get a deal, which is awesome. Tight fit, but this should work. Hmm. I'm playing this because I, it's the 15th where I am. Can you get Origin Access in Australia? Probably. That, that would be, that would be the, the my last resort. <laughs> It's only if everything goes to shit and I have no other choice. Those vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Nope, they're dirty. I guess they're pretty sturdy. Whoa, 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 dude. Calm down. Don't damage that premium content, bro. Whoa! Saw that coming. My erection. Yeah, I'm all right. Get off of me! I fell on my boner. Heal me, bro. Healing stem. You're full of surprises. That was angel dust, nice. buddy. Better. <laughs> Thanks, little droid. <clears throat> Wait, what? Okay. Let's try this again. Oh, uh. Okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Hop on board. Climb into my ass. So, how'd you get here? <laughs> Don't remember? I've never known a forgetful droid. The maintenance guy's gonna come through here and be like, who is who is cutting down all of these very, very important cables? That was a load-bearing thing. Those are load-bearing rods right there. Oh, I thought you just put it up to get in people's way and we just had to chop them down. Do you even listen to yourself? No, they're there for a reason, dude. Whoa! <clears throat> hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? I guess not. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you find something, BD1? I guess. <laughs> a new emitter. Oh, N.O. Cordova. You can change lightsaber parts on workbenches. Can I? I've already got that premium content, so I think I'm pretty set. <laughs> That's where we need to go. I can feel it. Mm-hmm. That's where we need to go. Platypus! Oh! He's turned off his tutorial system! Platypus, thank you very much for the 46 months, my friend. It's so wonderful to see you. Hope everything's going all right, my dude. Die! Thank you so very much, dude. How the hell are you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so this is... Yikes. I think that might be a little bit too far for us to, 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 to jump. Oh, this might this might be okay. No, I don't think so. I don't think we can jump over that way. yep Nope, it was worth a shot. Oh my, hey! Whoa, my frames, my frames. Jesus. Platypus, my man. It's good to see you, brother. It's pretty. It's so far. It's pretty good. We've we're basically just in the in the tutorial, the tutorial system. I gotta go through all this shit again. Oh, well, don't fall down, dude. Hermit's abode. Uh, tempo. So far, it's pretty good. I can't wait to ch uh, to try it on my PS4 Pro. If I if I ever if I ever get it get my stuff in, can't wait to give it a try. <laughs> Illuminate. <clears throat> the 
Does it come with a does it come with a free Disney Plus subscription? Does it really? That would be sweet. I, I, I don't I I heard somebody just said that uh, Australia is getting Disney Plus uh, in like a week. So that's kind of neat. It comes with it comes with a Disney Plus subscription, but you can only watch you can only stream uh, old fifties Mickey Mouse cartoons for the first year. There's only so many times I can watch uh, Tugboat Willie until I want to puke. I guess we can't really go across anywhere over here. Ste Steamboat, Steamboat Willie, <laughs> Tugboat Willie, Tug Job Willie. Okay. Yeah, all of the epi all of the old Mickey Mouse episodes that involve blackface are you're able to stream. So that's something. You mapped everywhere we've been. Well done. Trav and Dave, thank you for the host. I will be streaming. I'm going to stream streaming all day and and all night here. So um, it's only 11:30 a.m. So we'll be going like cray cray. Switch elevation to highlight different areas of the map. Right, 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 right. Okay. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. I gotta freaking find another way. 32? Whatever. <clears throat> Halloween Town and Brink! Wow. <laughs> I have no desire whatsoever to watch those. But hey. Die, Star Wars monster! Where are you going? What's up, Dippo? All right, Paul, we'll see you soon. Logano Don, the new poncho material. This is basically about just getting ponchos. Oh, here we go. Oh. Scan it, dude. Good job. Hey, good job. Good job. We'll burrow into the ground as a deception before attacking. Easy to parry, avoid being surrounded. Well, that's pretty standard with most enemies, I guess. A common pest, the bog rat, is a simple predator that feeds off small creatures like boglings. Their poor eyesight makes them easy prey to their natural enemy, the Ogdo. Often attacking in packs, they will surround their foes in numbers. Appearing to retreat, they are known to burrow below ground as a slide defense before springing to attack, surprising their prey. Their hardened skin makes them somewhat resistant to lightsaber attacks. Oh my god, this is the this is the Ogdo Bogdo. <clears throat> uh Honey Boo Boo's mom. Sever the tongue with a combination of the force and lightsaber attacks. Highly aggressive, tremendous speed, powerful stamina, and lightsaber resistant. Known to sell drugs to middle school students as well. The rare Ogdo Bogdo is a friend, friend, fiend, fiendishly formidable abomination, even deadlier than its common relative. The hyper-aggressive predator attacks with ferocity, constantly maneuvering towards its prey to inflict greater injury at close range. The creature's speed and stamina are unmatched, making it difficult to parry or strike uh, its lightsaber-resistant shell straight on. Great. Drugs! Zoop. Na, 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 na. My poncho senses are tingling. This tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. Halloween Town 3. I'm more of a, I'm more of a smart house kind of guy. Research notes, meticulous, meticulous handcrafted notes on the energy sphere left behind the researcher on Bogano. Someone lived here for some time using the larder for storage and provisions. A tool used by a traveler who wanted to reach the mysterious vault. A man of culture. That's right. Yeah, it's going to respawn anyway. That's fine. Yeah. 
I see you have premium content. I see. I see your premium content is is as premium as mine. Google Home is pretty much smart house. Oh! Missed opportunity, bro. Shit, there's another one. Dear God in heaven. Run for it! Run for it, dude. Run for it. I can't get it to work. Your lack of premium content is disturbing. <laughs> what a loser! No! Oh! Hey! Just do the su do do a super jump. <clears throat> Baki Hanma, what's up, dude? I have the premium content. He's turned off his pre-order bonus. Hmm. <laughs> Cal, what are you doing? Trust me, I've got this. Get off my back, bro. Okay, so there's some sort of secrety secret down there. This is a bit like Star Wars Uncharted, isn't it? What do you say there, kid? Sully! at you. Whoa. Scan it, dude. Scan it. The parafish. Parafish? Parafish inhabit large bodies of water, feeding primarily on small algae fragments and other plants. When algae supplies grow scarce, many fish die off. Their decompos decomposition process raises the acidity of the water, gradually wearing away at the ground below and forming sinkholes. Stinkholes. <laughs> Funny. Not today, Buster! New terrarium seed acquired. Good, 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 good. Slice it. I'm gonna need you to really hunker down. I need you to... Okay. These guys actually give some pretty good experience. Hey, no, hey. So those those switches don't do anything, I don't reckon. I don't reckon so. We need like some sort of super jump. I think we gotta get super jumps. Die! I'm guessing you can only be like a good Jedi in this. Yeah, you can only be a Jedi. I'd like to be a. I would love to be a Sith Lord, because they're just way cooler. And they and they. I'm sure they just get the hottest chicks, the hottest, the, the hottest Star Wars monsters. Scanning again. Oh yeah, dude. You should be, totally become a Sith Lord, man. My girlfriend, she's got four tentacles that come out of her butthole, and that's good. Oh, yeah. 
<clears throat> Zar thrive in rocky, windy habitats where their low stance and adhesive grip provide fast and agile traversal over multiple surfaces like cavern walls. Highly sensitive to climate, they function slower in warmer temperatures than colder ones. That's really good. <laughs> ah. Huh? Everybody misses Kevin Sorbo. See something in there? I was watching her, her, The Adventures of Hercules the other day, and I was bawling for like an hour. I could not be consoled. I was just, I was bawling my eyes out. Disappointed! You want me to run across? You want me to run on that wall, dude? Oh, the wall run. Try again. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. Well, you told me you took an online Jedi impossible. course. But with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Do what you must to reach me. Faster, more intensely. Faster, more intensely. Now, reach my position. Yep. Oh. I got the wall around you. I did it. I freaking did it. Persistence and the force is my ally. Sure, sure. Pretty standard Just stuff. Remembering old tricks. Pretty standard, I'd say. Let's go try to run up this. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Do you? Reach the bolt. Okay, I'm not really. Okay. That's the shortcut. Great. Sure. I'm just exploring right now. Can you show me that truck right again? Hmm, that looks pretty rough. Actually, you know what? Well, <laughs> I don't think we can just like run up this, can we? <clears throat> and remember, only some walls you can do a wall run on. It's not indicated which walls you can do it on, but eventually, if you play the game enough, you'll recognize them. <clears throat> oh. Okay, well, that kind of changes everything, doesn't it? Got it. Can't, we can't wall run on that, bro. Remember the briefing, dude. Remember your online courses that you took. Just remember. <laughs> so we can't. We, we don't want to. Damn, that was pretty cool, though. <laughs> I wonder if we could do this. You got it! Whoa! You... You... Ugh. I don't think there's anything up there anyway. There might be. We're gonna give that one more shot. You ran too long, buddy. Get over there! That may be doo-doos. That could be that could be some duties, yeah. So I guess we just gotta head out of here and wall wall run ourselves to victory, huh? -da 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 -da.
I see. Were we, we weren't able to wall run on that before. Can I wall run on, up here on the second floor? I guess I can. Oh, that's new. Let's get out of here. Horse apples. Old man Clemens hates shit. Hello? Hey! Oh, something was in there. Something was in there. New lightsaber switch. Oh, yes, dude. That's so badass. Oh, we've unlocked the shortcut. Watch out! He's got premium content! Rough your life! Damn, these guys are good. Super jump. Oh, great. There's one right behind me. There's one right behind me, isn't there? Attack in large groups able uh, and able to contort. Evasive strikes, but easily killed. Splocks are large, agile insects, usually found in groups and known to launch coordinated attacks to overwhelm their prey. They are om omnivorous and use small, thin, sprite-like wings to hover over terrain. They're able to contort their shape to quickly stagger their enemies, pro providing time for others in the pack to strike, providing they stop soaping their ass. Oh! Oh, God. No! I'm dead. <laughs> No! Thank God we just meditated, bro. Uh, so the real the real punishment, it seems, on PS4 is the long load times. Cause there is there's some pretty there's some pretty girthy load times here, dude. <clears throat> a long, long load time away in a galaxy far, far away. <clears throat> They're waiting for me to finish reading. They probably know how important reading is. It's very important. A big you want a big load? You want a bigger load? Be a baby. I'm talking about the goo goos, the gagas. I'm talking about drinking the milk. Wow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You like them apples? <laughs> Jordy. I'm talking about the Goo Goos, the Gagas. Talking about drinking them out. What's up, Louie? How are you, dude? Let's get up there. Is this linear or open world? Uh, so far, it's tutorial. So I'm not sure what you take. I'm not sure what you'll take out of that. But so far, it's tutorial time. Damn, these guys are good. My force meter is empty. Yeah. yeah. Oh. oh my god. Can you slice this? 
You want to slice this? Yeah. Sorry about your scalp link. What are the difficulty towards? You have four right? difficulties. We're on the third difficulty. <clears throat> so we are like... Ginger Jedi or something like that. The, the hardest is like Master Jedi. I don't know. <clears throat> I can't remember what it is. So this is this is this. <clears throat> oh, a scomp link must be repaired. Of course, it's pretty standard, I guess. Well played, sir. Well played. Ho 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 ho. Wait, you didn't repair the scomp link? Uncle Owen! Uncle Owen! Racy there? Oh, it's on. Gotta work that premium content, dude. Oh, yeah. Let's see what's back here. <laughs> the lightsaber matches the drapes, dude. It does. <laughs> It does. And Cal looks like the kind of guy, even though he's so young, he probably has really, really long, thick pubic hairs. I'm pretty I'm pretty good at spotting that. Very thick, very coarse. <clears throat> Uncle Owen. Just Door's locked down. on the other side. Just chop, just chopping that shit up. Get up. Get up. <clears throat> this is another shorty here. Oh yeah. Looks like we can uh, get ourselves another skill point. <clears throat> J base guy. Well, thanks for thanks for watching, dude. We're gonna get ourselves another skill. maximum force has been increased. His maximum life has increased. <clears throat> Hold triangle. Hold triangle, Luke. Cal dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. How is that? Flip over the target. That's kind of cool. Cal can perform another powerful attack. With an overhead slash. Defenses are improved. Less block stamina damage from incoming attacks. Now that's something I can get into. Attacking after a quick evade allows okay, to do a kick attack. That's pretty sweet too. I think I like this one a lot too. Dashes forward and attacks his target. Uh, jump while dashing, flip over target instead. That's pretty, that's pretty badass. That's pretty cool. J Base God, well, thank you. I appreciate that, my friends. <laughs> the Forest's <is> Triangle. <laughs> Use the tutorial, Luke. Cool. Wow, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. We. Yeah. Looks like there's things down there. Oh, it's probably, yeah, it's probably down there. <coughs> right. Not a lot of uh, things that you can destroy. Most everything is for decorations. Not a lot of destroyable environment stuff. Yeah, uh, Chuckle Fox, no worries, dude. Yeah, don't, don't spoil. If you're going to play this game, by all means, please don't, don't spoil it for yourself. Yeah, that's not a good idea. This is all very dangerous.
See that building over there? Um, oh, yeah, this one? Yeah, I do. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. Oh, there's another meditation. Okay, all right. Well, I guess since we'll we'll meditate here so we have a, a checkpoint, but really quick, guys, I do have to take a quick uh, little bathroom break, just like two minutes. If you're new to the stream and you're going to be taking off, make sure you hit the follow button before you do. I usually take about a two-minute break. Really, there's... It's nothing for me to do except for go to the bathroom. So I'll be right back, guys. Enjoy some music. This is Approaching Nirvana. It's called Don't. Make sure you hit the follow button on the channel, as well as there is merch. The merch store is is up, and we got this thing. The Mean Street shirt is back, baby, and it's available for you right there. It just got launched at the beginning of this stream, so check it out. We got hoodies. We have T-shirts. We have T-shirts that have sleeves attached to them as well, which is like a long sleeve thing. So uh, stick around, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back, guys. Enjoy the music. I'll, I'm also on Twitter at Alaskan Savage TV. I'm an explorer, that's true. I like to uh, I like to see everything, especially, you know, it's Star Wars. So I'm a, I'm a big um, big fan of like reading everything about the Star Wars universe, all those little tidbits. Enjoy very much. All right. Let's get into this thing. Here we go. Mm -mm 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 we don't really take too too long of breaks here. I don't like to take long breaks. <clears throat> wow. Okay, I'll look. It is a bit it is a bit soulsy. It's nice job. But it's not super duper soulsy so far it's got kind of the same combat mechanics but it still feels very star warsy if that makes any sense offerings these relics contain materials that aren't native to bagano their fragile structure indicates they were purely decorative potentially objects of religious significance it's possible they were carried here as a form of pilgrimage truth truth dude they call him the true The vault is built out of carnite, a hard stone rich in minerals. Its inner walls are decorated with metallic plating and inscriptions. The glyphs don't return results in any galactic databank, suggesting the language has been lost to time. Hmm. If I'm taking a shit, I take my time. That's for true. Poop time is me time. 
The frame, the frames are holding out pretty good. There's a couple of. I'm playing on a regular PS4, so you know, some drops are to, are to be expected, but it's really not. It's really not too bad. I don't, I don't get my my PS4 Pro. My PS4 Pro is still in the middle of the ocean. Or it's like going through customs right now. They're taking it apart to see how many drugs I've stuffed in there. <clears throat> This structure has been here for centuries. It appears the only way to open the vault is by using the force. The horse. Three thousand drugs. Amazing. Moving out. Moving out, moving out, moving out. Doodly. Doodly. Got a scan? <laughs> the lighting makes his face just makes him look like You're a right, fucking BD? ghoul. Well done, whoever you are. <laughs> you have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am master. Has this is the guy. Door. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. <clears throat> the fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. <laughs> this Aunt place, this... Is that all you got? ...vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. The single player Go game. To the Zepho homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. Remember the tutorial. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. Now your balls are wet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey, you want to meet some uh, friends of mine? <clears throat> Zepho. Wait, 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 wait. Secrets of the Vault. My friend, my name is Jedi Master Eno Cordova. The Bagano Vault, constructed by the Zepho millennia ago, granted me a vision of the Jedi's doom. To preserve the order, I've hidden a holocron. I've, I've placed a Ferrero Rocher, detailing the names and locations of all known young Force sensitives deep within the vault. To access the holocron, you must seek out the tombs of three great Zepho sages. BD-1 will aid you on your journey. He will be your guide. A Ferrero Rocher. Can I scan this, this, this stuff? No scans. <clears throat> Yeah, his balls are sopping wet now.
think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Here, here, here. Okay. We're gonna go back out to go over to the ship. There's only one secret. This is on PS4, yeah. Oh, Lord. Huh. Whoa, my friends. I'm gonna get back there. <laughs> what is this? What are those things? Ah, probably the... The shortcut that we opened up, I, I guess. Oh, we, this was the shortcut right there. Mm hmm. I didn't want to go up there. That guy's pretty spooky. I'm not really sure if we can fight those frogs yet. They kill us almost in one hit. We've got a lot of health. Can we go up? Probably not. Die! Another frog! <clears throat> yeah, I didn't want to... I, I was thinking about getting it on... on PC, but... Oh, man. I just don't know. I just don't know, dude. I'm still on Sarah's laptop, so I, I'm not sure how... How well it would work. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Whoever owned this bag brought it from Coruscant. They were frustrated with the Jedi Council. Frustration. A bag left by someone who came here from Coruscant. They were strangely frustrated with the Jedi Council for some reason. Were they really? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What the? Okay, we got a we got a target for that that charge. I think. How does he know that? He has a a rare condition. That allows him to see things like that. Or to, to find stuff out. Okay. It is kind of, it is kind of open. It's a little bit open. Open world. Between, but it's kind of riding the line between linear and, and open world, I guess. Because they give you these big, these big areas that you can kind of go around and and do what do what you want, explore stuff. It's like stages, like levels. That <laughs> main characterized. It's very rare. Oh, almost got him. The greed. Yeah. Scan him. Scan him quickly. What's this? That was a lot of uh, experience. Oh, we already read that. Oh, no, did we? It's highly threatening alpha predator at the top of the Bogano food chain. This creature attacks with an adhesive tongue capable of reaching eight meters in length that latches onto its prey, then pulls them into its jaws. This form of strike is particularly effective against most foes due to its thick hide. It's able to resist straight-on lightsaber attacks. It's extremely dangerous at close range. Mm 
You don't say. Whoa. Whoa! It's gonna kill me! Hurting, dude. I'm hurting for a squirting. Mm, use tongue butthole. Yeah, I wasn't about to risk uh, an EA game on, on this laptop. I have... EA's got a pretty bad track record as far as my computers are concerned. I don't want to be spending this entire stream just trying to figure out how to stop the crashing. So I went with PS4. <clears throat> also... <laughs> Also, getting a getting a, a hard copy like a like a disc, getting getting the actual hard copy of this game, cut my my download time uh, by about four hours because I live in in Australia. So that's good too. Okay, that just goes right back there. How is this a shortcut? Hmm. I'm dead. No! Oh, one wrong move, dude. <clears throat> oh, BB Stimshot. That's right. Up. Okay, so we I forgot that we can we can heal ourselves. I wonder. Yeah, this isn't even the hardest difficulty either. This is the this is the second hardest difficulty out of four. I wonder. I wonder how, how many of those we get. Probably just regenerates over time. I suppose. Douche. So far, it is pretty pretty difficult. But then again, I don't really know. I I, I, for, I forgot that I, I I could heal, so that sh that tells you something. You shit. Yay! You, I think you really got to parry, dude. You really got to get your parries on in this in this game. Ow! Combat's pretty good, man. Pretty fluid. Feels nice. Shit! Come on, parry that turd. All right, let's try Damn. this. Stim me, baby. Nice assist. Joy. Okay, now how is that a shortcut? It doesn't really bring us back anywhere. All right, I guess we'll just go across the way. Can we even get up that side? I don't even know. Can I go up? <laughs> Can I can I use that? Can I use this to go up? I'm afraid to jump over. I don't think we could use this just to go up. No, no. Okay. <laughs> Thought there might be like some sort of hand crank.
Oh, that's a un. You can. Oh. Uh. Stim, now stim me. Shit. Oof. Wow. I don't think we can go this way. How the fuck do we get back, dude? Maybe down here, I guess. Straight across? Oh, that's right. Yeah, we do have to go straight across. It was the it was the shortcut that I was thinking of before. So we obviously need to come back here at some point and open these up. Frog legs is back on the menu, boys. Can't go down there yet. Huh? Harsh? My friend. It appears the Cepho had some interest in Dathomir. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. So dark. My friend, I recently discovered that Zepho had some interest in Dathomir. Strange for such a culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so... Dark. There's more to be discovered. Dark. I'm guessing, yeah, they, they reset on, uh... It's your... It's your... It's your Star Wars Estus. They reset when you, when you meditate. Attacking after a quick evade allows Cal to form a kick attack. Attacking out of a sprint. Form a special lightsaber attack. That is kind of fun. That does seem kind of fun, doesn't it? Ooh. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> Used to live in Kenai. Am I streaming from inside? I'm inside the house. Uh, I live in Australia now with my wife, but um, I'm from Wasilla, Alaska. I lived there for 30 years. I worked at a fish processing plant right outside of Kenai one time for a summer. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. like that, wouldn't you, you PC shit? Hmm. I wonder now if I could go do this thing. He's inside the house. I don't think so, dude. I don't think we can do this yet. I don't think we can run along these walls. We need some sort of super mega jump. Super ultra mega jump. Probably some sort of mega ultra force jump, yeah. Hi there. Hey, how are ya? Seems new. Well, there is something over there. But I don't think we can make that jump. Dear God! 
Oh, it's this fucking thing. Oh, damn it. You missed him. Yeah. Bum ba da bum bum on then on then on then on. That is not where he wanted to go. <sighs> Leftover your ta uh, taco leftovers mixed with some rice, some hot sauce. Nice, dude. I guess we do have to <clears throat> make the long jump. Doop. Good. <laughs> Or we just use this goddamn thing. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -bi -di 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 <laughs> okay. Looks like we're gonna have to run along the wall right when we land. Or when we get over there. Clever! Do 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 do. Whoa, these. My frames, my frames. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da -ba 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 <clears throat> Scomp Link must be repaired. The Ska Link. The Mighty Mighty Boss Tones Link. <clears throat> Indeed, I, I requested a uh, I requested a, a key for Romancing Saga three. Hopefully I get it. I've never I've never played that before. I would love to play it. Thank you, more Lord. Ooh. Moving out. Hey, we're moving out for Pete's sakes. It's down here. Oh, hey there, little guy. Hey, bud. How are you? <laughs> wow. Okay. Do it. We need some sort of mega mega force. It's the Mega Force. Okay. If this game is just, uh, if if it's just a game being unoptimized, yeah, maybe. I mean, some sometimes with some games, I get drops on my regular PS4. I really, I re I'm really missing my PS4 Pro. Passed the test. So you knew about BD1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. That's I don't comedy. Care who he's with? Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of patrolling weed fabric? Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Uh, this is out pretty soon, yeah. It is if He's you're in course. Australia. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. 
Okay, no problem. Let's get it. Well, except the holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where something we about a checking just account. Because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that <clears throat> changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. <laughs> Death mirrors Zepho. It's your choice. Multiple entries. Rebuilding the Jedi Order. After revealing she no longer uses the Force, Siri sent Cal to an ancient vault. Along the way, Cal found a friendly droid named BD-1 who joined the, his quest. On their journey, Cal reached out to the Force. Remembering this ability to wall run inside the vault, BD projected a message from Master Eno Cordova detailing how he hid a holocron containing a list of known Force-sensitive children, not the younglings! To access it, Cal must find the tombs of three Zepho sages. With BD's aid, Cal embarks on a journey to rebuild the Jedi Order. <clears throat> and fine prints like Rebuilding Jedi Order 599. EA, you've done it again, you rascal. Hey, Grease, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of Umbaran glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. I already did find them. I found one. And that's the, the Kelpie. I found the Kelpie one, okay. So we're growing space weed now. It's pretty, it's pretty bosh house. Find me some space weed. Uh oh yeah, we got we got some new stuff here. Come, 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 come. <laughs> look at that, look at all this premium content, dude. There's some serious premium content, Rosie. Oh wow. Well, I mean it's no premium content. It's like a candlestick holder. Let's stick to my premium content, thank you very much. The spa the space share. It's a harsh in my space mellow. <clears throat> well we're gonna go we're not gonna go to Zepho first. We're gonna go to the other one. It seems it seems more extra. It seems more like an extra place. Yeah, now you're thinking, let's get out of here. Yeah. Bloody legend. Search Zepho. Zepho. Bogando. Was it 16 chests, dude? 14. Okay. I guess we could go to Death Mirror. You guess? I'm the Setting main character. Course of course we're going. Wait a minute. You want to go to Dathomir? I'm surprised Cordova went there. He must have had good reason. I am staying put on the manis once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. This place used to be home to a powerful cabal of force wielders known as the Night Sisters. Do I have a seat? Force? What? Like Jedi? No. These witches served only themselves. These bitches. Their powers focused on deception, illusion. <clears throat> Manipulation. <laughs> Sounds like someone I used to know. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Dathomir is a deadly place. We should be careful. 
<laughs> Don't have to tell me twice. She speaks so ominously. Hey, we're friends here. You don't need to talk like that. Or he's, what are you doing? The Night Sisters of Dathomir were a coven of powerful Force sensitives, skilled in the use of magic. An expression of the Force unknown to Jedi or Sith, they previously ruled Dathomir. Night Sisters' society was strictly matriarchal, no boys allowed. With the coven answering, no boys, no boys, no boys. <clears throat> Night brother, the, the, the lower Knight Brother class. Their civilization was destroyed at the behest of a vengeful Count Dooku after Asajj Ventress and her sisters attempted to assassinate him. Count Dooku. My least favorite count. Up on our creepy destination. Grab some seat, kid. Soul Slicer, what's up? Grab some freaking seat over here. That's what I was wondering, dude. Grab some soft serve. I said YouTube. I was I was yelling that earlier. Uncle Owen, Uncle Owen. But I was gonna go meet my friends to go grab some power converters. Uncle Owen. Yeah. Be careful here. You're this being, is a dead, you're being a little bitch, Luke. Place. Hang on. Power converters. That's what you're into these days. Wow. <clears throat> I'm Baru! <laughs> Hi. Um, Do you know anything about the Night Sisters of Dathomir? I knew a little. Many Jedi weren't even aware of their existence, but being Cordova's apprentice came with some unique insight. He always thought they were interesting, as he did with most ancient cultures. And what did you think? I never came here. I never wanted to. As I recall, that was about the time the two of us began going our separate ways. The darkness always has an effect, one way or another. Yeah. BD-1, keep an eye on Cal for us. BD-1, you rascal. It's okay, Grease. You'll be okay. You're with Jedi. It's safe. <laughs> I'm safe. Who's there? Oh, Cal. Whew. Are we ready to go? Just checking on you. I'm fine, just fine. Just very much ready to get off this planet. I've heard the stories, witches, living dead. Don't you have a job to do? Come on already. I'll get right on it. Okay, good, hurry it up. I'll be right here with Truly, it's safe, yeah, you too. If there is such a place. If there is such a place. I'm a, I'm a Star Wars monster. Look at me, I, I'm really weird looking. We'll be okay, Grease. We're all here to protect each other. Kid, I don't know if you're messing around with me or not, but I am fully expecting you to do just that, and if you don't, I'll haunt you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Need anything, Grease? Oh, yeah, sure. I'm really in the mood for a slow and painful death. Grease. You think you could find that sort of thing on this death planet? <laughs> That's comedy. Or maybe just bring me back something that will haunt me for the rest of my dreadful life. Any of that work, you weirdo? You're funny, dude. I'm busy. I gotta figure out what to cook next. Grease, you freaking rascal. You are just a little rascal. <clears throat> oh, cool. I like how, like, the recap of the chapter was like, Cal was on a dangerous voyage, and he stopped at this one place, and he remembered how to wall wall, to wall run. Yeah, he sure did. Maybe there's more tutorial stuff in the future. I think we weren't standing there. Who knows? Stay tuned to find out. Oh! Good thing we fell in the pit! Ugh! on him being friendly. <clears throat> How can you tell? Everybody looks like a scary monster in the Star Wars universe. It doesn't look like he's very friendly. Or, actually, you know, he might be. He could be funny. Like that one guy. He's funny, dude. Ooh. 
Moving out. Yeah, yeah, imagine, yeah, agrees just looking out. Watch, watch me jump in the pit. We are truly doomed. Oh, wait, no, he's back. We might be okay. Oh, I've got a premium, premium content lightsaber. Bros of... <clears throat> Capable of launching range attacks of venomous saliva. Click, click, boom! Upon death, <laughs> it plays loud recordings of saliva. <clears throat> Upon death, corpse will emit a toxic acid. The vile bane back spider is a venomous foe to be reckoned with, primarily a hole dweller. They are known to skitter and climb with agility. When encountered, they can project venomous saliva at enemies with a range of up to 12 meters, up to 12 parsecs. Caution should be taken if they are killed due to emission of a toxic acid that will pull out from their corpse upon death. Pretty standard. Okay. Is this a good game? Uh, it's been a good tutorial. That's for true. The tutorial has been... It just fucking blew my mind, dude. So far, it's okay. Oh. This tutorial, I learned so much in the tutorial. <laughs> Hydratus. The Hydratus grow, grows in dry, rocky areas. Air is filtered through its filaments, which trap dust and bacteria. Once filtered, the filaments con contract to lock clean air inside, creating a human environment where the Hydratus can absorb the small amount of water it needs to survive. It's all very, very interesting, very interesting stuff. It's very interesting. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 yo, Corbin Dallas, shorter. Here we go, motherfucker. Yo, bitch. Whoa. <clears throat> That's not a door. Dicka 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 Ow, you shit. <clears throat> do it, do it. What's up, Z-Man? The game so far, is pr it's been pretty good, man. It's been pretty good. I've been having a good time. I mean, I, I really, really enjoy Star Wars, so I'm going to be going real easy on it. I got it for PS4 so that I wouldn't be distracted with all the crashing because it's EA and I have no doubt that I would be crashing constantly. Yeah. <clears throat> Come back here. Hey, what the heck? What was well, in there? I'm not saying that I'm not saying that you guys would be crashing. You know, like, I just seem to have some pretty bad luck when it comes to uh, bugs and, and, and games crashing and shit like that. I'm sure you guys are going to be just fine. Ah. Cricket, you rascal. Oh! Okay. <clears throat> You little scamp. Dun 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 da da dun dun. Dun da 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 dun dun. I want stuck up half-witted scruffy looking nerf herder. Cricket Slayer, thank you so very much for Whoa! Thank you so much for the for the uh for the Twitch Prime, my friend. I do appreciate that. Welcome aboard. Enjoy the emotes and of course the commercial free viewing. I do appreciate that support very, very much. I hope you know that. Oh! Oh god. Now! Noish! <clears throat> Who are you calling scruffy looking? <laughs> Thank you so much, Cricket Slayer! Thank you very, very much, my friend. And welcome aboard. Let's go, BD1. Wait, 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 wait. What did you what did you want? You wanted to do something. You wanted something. What? 
Find something? Oh yeah, Tempo, that's true. What the heck? No data found. Appearance suggested nothing good. Uh, so we need some sort of mega force. Super ultra force. Colin. Use the mega ultra force. The droid companion is pretty pretty awesome. Yeah, that's true. Can I just grab onto this? Or is this gonna kill me dead if I do this? It's gonna kill me. Yep. I tried. <laughs> Can you not climb down? Oh wait. No, I guess not. I really just wanted to climb down. I guess you can't climb down, but you can climb up. That's very confusing. Hmm. I guess you don't really die when you fall off of stuff, which is pretty good because I tend to fall off a lot of stuff. I'm surprised I'm still in my chair right now. Scomp Link. Hmm. Looks like the Zeppo were here. Whoa! This seems abandoned, but... You trespass, Jedi. You must be a night sister. I had heard you were all dead. Not all. Dothamir is forbidden you to must you. Be Goldberg. Leave at once. Well, I'm afraid I can't do that, but perhaps we could help each other. You see, I... Easy. I'm not your enemy. Your actions say otherwise. Wait, hold on. I'm not here to... Oh, it's that's the unavoidable. Wow, <laughs> just a what the one shot out. <laughs> okay, uh, well at least we got that shortcut, I guess. Oh man, <clears throat> demons. Local pops, what's up? So the when they when they flash red, I tried to I tried to parry, but when they flash red, it's a it's an un unparryable, unblockable attack. I gotta remember that. <laughs> What'd you freaking do? <clears throat> Too bad we're not fighting Count Dooku. We could just hide his hide his medication, hide his pills. Uh, maybe, maybe because I'm so into Star Wars, I guess it doesn't really feel like Dark Souls to me. It, it feels, it feels like, it feels like I'm in this, it feels like I'm in a Star War. Ugh! It feels like I'm in a Star War. When did, when did this release? Um, in, in, in a couple of hours it releases, I think, unless you're in Australia, like me, then it's out. I picked my copy up at, at 9 a.m. Feels like I made a Star Wars. Fuck you. Hey. Stim, here. What's that? Uh, is this game any goods? Um, I mean, I've only just started, but so far the tutorial was, was, um, I learned a lot. 
and it's it's been been pretty okay. I guess we'll find out. I really can't make a final judgment unless I unless I play through at least like three quarters of the game. Shit! I need to go grab my experience, dude. Dun 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 dun. Tell us right now. Tell me if I need to spend the money. <laughs> oh, that's right. We have a shortcut. I really, I really hope that we can go Sith at some point. Oh my Christ. No, oh, man. That kills you so quick. <clears throat> Ginger Jedi, yeah. We're playing this on a hard mode, which I probably should not be doing because I'm not, um, I'm, no, I'm no Jedi. I'm no Jedi. You're always a good boy in this? Yeah, that's a shame. I'd like to be a bad, a bad boy. Good God. I don't think I don't think you can be evil in this. I it's I that'd be cool if you could. Okay. Let's go try it. Let's just try these guys again. Brothers, an intruder. Brothers. Very yeah, well. brother. Ow. Ah. Don't let him rally. You can't win, outsider. Ah. Brothers, aid me! Jason Fear! Don't lose sight of him! Stop him from moving! Where is your skill? Where's your skill? Remember the tutorial. Uh. the outsider! You missed him! You don't have real power! Jeez, that backswing. Good lord. Stim. We will defeat you. Move forward. <laughs> Fucking A, dude. You can't win, outsider. <laughs> uh, hey. You cannot hide your weakness. Yipes. Oh, Turn that back away. I need to use I need to slow use the force to slow down more. But if you use your force to slow down, then I won't have uh, any any force left to use my charge. So I think I have to to balance. That you gotta bring balance to the to the force meter. <laughs> Do I have one point? Do I really? I didn't know that I did. I thought I lost all my experience on those guys. Do you not lose your, your points as well? Let's go see. Finally. Finally. Glad you made it back in one piece. Hi, Star Wars monster. Hold it. What? 
What? The load times are pretty brutal on PS4, man. That is that is one thing for sure. Oh, I got a point, dude. Yeah, I do have a point. Nice. So I guess we should probably do these then, huh? Maximum life. That might be kind of nice to have. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it will be quite operational. <clears throat> What do these guys want? They want some some to talk about something. I ran into a night sister. Yeah. What happened? I died Are like okay? four times. I'm fine. Although she made it clear we're not welcome. She wasn't alone. The night brother? I think so. Oh no. There's more of them? I don't know much, but Cordova told me the night brother served the witches of Dathomir. You're lucky to be alive, Cal. Well, I wasn't alive. Please, I died like leaving. four times. It's an option. We can always come back here later if you're not ready, Cal. Okay, well, I did die, so remember that. Night Sisters are very powerful. Be ready for anything out there. Should I, I should probably brush up on Sister Act and Sister Act 2, just, just so I know what I'm up against. Please do me a favor and hurry up at this place. It gives me the creeps. Okay. Give me the freaking creeps over here. Yeah. <laughs> Weird cat gremlin. I like to call them Star Wars monsters. The beeps, the creeps, and the sweeps. <laughs> Brothers, I understand. Oh, you just have to hit. Oh, you just have to hit them, I guess. Try me, Whoa. I'm talking about the future, Jack. Fuck you! Oh, that that hit point upgrade really helped a lot, though. Prepare to die, Jedi. You won't kill me. Fuck off. Okay, much better with more life. I'll tell you that right now. The the life upgrade gives you so much life. I haven't found any bugs or anything yet now. Okay. Another skill point, very nice. <clears throat> Skilled and nimble strong def defense is advised including mindful opportunities to strike. Dodge their unblockable overhead attack. Night brothers are a male warrior subspecies of Zabrax based on Dathomir. For centuries, their simple society was governed by Night Sisters, which is that ruled the planet but were decimated during the Clone Wars. Territorial, territorial, tutorial, and extremely hostile to outsiders, fighters in their ranks are highly ac acrobatic, agile, and proficient in a variety of mixed combat. And they're excellent cooks as well. Most of them have been on the popular show Chopped, Many have lost, but some have won. <laughs> wow. Uh, uh, well. Okay. Let's go. Well, obviously, these these uh, health and force upgrades are going to be just absolutely amazing. Paramounts. So let's do that. Max force increase as well. Mm-hmm. The Terra Tutorial. Do <laughs> 
How do I like it so far? I like it. I'm, I'm liking it a lot. It's, it's pretty. Uh, it's pretty cool. But I'm, I'm a huge fan of. Whoa. We're night brothers. Huge fan of uh, Star Wars, so that helps as well. Snap. Not so bad. Fuck you. What is happening? What's going on? No! Don't do that! What, what are you doing? Below us, brothers! See you later, dickwad. Ow! Great Jeez, I'm crow. Knight Brother Archer. A society of male warriors and knight brothers are a subspecies. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. For centuries, their society existed in loyal reverence to the Knight Sisters, which is that ruled the planet, but were decimated during the Clone Wars, from the hostile... Yeah, yada, yada, yada. Among their ranks may be found archers, capable of launching ranged energy bow attacks with deadly accuracy. Absolute decadence. Listen, thank you for the host, man. Oh, the bonfire, dude. Whoa! Uh. Whoa! Damn it! I need one! Your blows are Jesus. Back it up, back it up. Nice jumps, dude. You're going to buy it. Thank you for your input. Well, I hope you enjoy it, man. I hope you enjoy it. Hopefully, we don't get to the next chapter. And I was like, oh, man, I probably shouldn't have said such good things. <laughs> no, hopefully, it's good. Jesus. Da, 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 da. Get him, Outsiders. Damn it. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. You piece of trash. I'll catch you. Enough running. I'll take it worse. Uh. Wow. No healing. You love Star Wars, sure you'd be happy with it? Yeah, man. I also enjoy Star Wars. Somebody there? I guess it was just a it was just a space win. Hey now. What do we find? Spoiler alert, there's racers in this. Wow. We don't have any heals, man. We better better go back. <laughs> I guess it was just the space wind. It must have been nothing. Oh, skill tree. Here we go. So what's over here? Allowing him to take less block stamina damage from incoming attacks. Holding... Slow allows Cal to slow his target for a longer duration. Hold R1. Mm hmm. Perform another powerful attack after the overhead slash. I'm thinking this guy right here. I'm thinking Arby's. Hold L1. 
Actually, you know what? I'm tr I'm trying to do. If I'm I'm not really blocking. I'm just parrying. Poker bow, what's up? I'm not really blocking. I'm just parrying. So I just roll out of the way when this shit gets cray cray for a longer duration. This might be pretty nice. Freeze, mother trucker. <laughs> yeah. What an idiot. Okay. Boy, boy, boy. Ah, oh, damn it. Shit. Keep on him. There's a ass load of them. Jesus. Fuck off Toss with it. the piece of shit. What is, what's happening? No! <sighs> okay, I tried to, t so <laughs> I'm trying to target these guys. <laughs> I'm trying to target them. And uh, it makes me sit down. It makes me sit down. An intruder! You will fall! Your death is assured! Did I coward? Is it a good game? So far, yeah. So far, I'm enjoying it. Having a good time. Interloper! Oh, you turn. Don't, don't take it in. Don't, don't take it in. We don't have a force push. No, all we have is a slow. We just have a force slow. What do the microtransactions get you? You've made a mistake, I have pre I've got premium pre-order content, bro. Pre-order. Like, I'm rocking that that premium content. She do She needs premium, bro. Guys are so sneaky. Don't dig it, don't, don't dig it, don't, don't dig it. Okay. Game Guru, thanks for the host. How's the game? I'm really enjoying it. Uh, we're a couple of hours in. I'm very much enjoying it. Oh, no. 
we're like uh, coming up on three hours into the game. <laughs> the, sp the spiders and the Darth Maul people are in cahoots, man. They probably just see them as another spooky Star Wars monster that we see everywhere. They could be nice. They could be funny. They could be bad guys. You don't know. They all look like scary monsters. This is the shortcut you're looking for. There's a there's a, a guy over there. Very dark souls. I just, I just feel it feels very Star Wars to me. I'm, I'm really, I'm really digging it. Out. It's, it's very, very Star Warsy. Just, it, yeah, so this game is a lot like Dark Souls. It's the, it's the Star Wars of... Uh, it's the Dark Souls of Star Wars games, like how Shower With Your Dad Simulator is the Dark Souls of Showering With Your Dad. You know, it's, pre it's, all, it's, it's all pretty standard stuff. The double-bladed lightsaber, the double-bladed lightsaber excels at crowd control. Use the force attack to over overwhelm and clear large groups. Continue blocking after successfully reflecting a blaster bolt to reflect additional bolts back to your enemies. Yeah. Oh, cool. Nice. You're whiffing it, dude. You're really whiffing it now. Die, replacement friend! <laughs> so there was there was a guy back there. Kinda wanna go talk to that bro. There's a there's a hooded figure up here. Oh, fellow wanderer. Ooh. I see you met the resident knight sister. Enemies do respawn at save points. Unlike most, you're alive. <laughs> what lightsaber? No, no, don't hide it. That would explain your survival. Whip that fat thing out. Why? I want to see it. No, no, no one to fear. <laughs> Just a traveler, studying the nature of extinct cultures and dead philosophies. You study the Night Sisters? I study many things. We're on chapter nine in Death Stranding right now. What? Yes, that Night Sister. Oh. She was only a child when the war came to this world. She had to watch her whole family perish. What do you know about those ruins? Oh, oh. Ancient beyond belief. 
The Night Sister and her warrior kin were seduced by the power that lurks within. Why are we whispering? Avoid the ruin. Or suffer the same fate. After landing on Dothamir Cal and BD-1 faced off against Night Sisters, who demanded they leave the planet immediately. When they refused, she commanded Night Brothers to attack them. Shortly after escaping that threat, Cal and BD-1 came upon a wanderer who claimed to be studying Zephyr ruins and had some pretty good deals on timeshares too, but we're still on the fence about it. Who he is and what's become of the Night Sisters remain to be seen. You wouldn't want to purchase a timeshare six weeks in the Bahamas. Bahamas? Uh, uh, I'll think about it. How do you know so much about the Night Sister? Observation. I've seen many things since coming here. What does that mean? Must it mean something? Too many great minds have gone astray in pursuit of order. Order. I gotta get going. I got. I, 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 I gotta go. <laughs> what is that scent? Is that Polo? No, oh, it's absolutely divine. I should go. How long have you been here? Long enough. This world provided a sanctum when I was in need. Shelter when I was weak. An enlightenment when I was lost in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> right. Sure. <laughs> I like your enthusiasm. But Dathomir demands more than wit or will. There's treasures down there that'll shimmer you blind. <laughs> I'll be picking your corpse clean. Hi. Okay, well, we're gonna... Go this way. Right. <laughs> Have you heard of butt cheek cleavage? It's really in these days. You should try it. <laughs> <laughs> You there. Halt! Damn, son. Ow, ow, ow. Cool, man. Drawn to something here. Energy from the ruins? Maybe some sort of freaking collectible or something? Temptation. Someone was headed toward the ruins. I felt the pull of the dark. Ancient energy. <laughs> sure. Huh. Ugh. Absolute decadence. <laughs> That's not a rope. <laughs> okay. So that's confusing. Why you stuck up half-witted, scruffy looking nerf herder? Lead fan, thank you very much for subbing up with the Twitch Prime. Subbing is the best way to support a streamer, and I do appreciate that very much. Enjoy the emotes, of course. The uh, commercial free viewing, which is super rad. <laughs> do not be tempted by things that look like ropes. Mm, young Padawan. As for they are not ropes. They're quite the opposite. Yeah, I can't jump that high. Yeah. Far. Yeah. Beep, boop, beep, boop, boop. Why don't you put a cork in it, BD1? Thank you very much. Are you stuck up, half-witted, scruffy-looking nerf herder? For some reason, the alert isn't, isn't working. It's just going to do that five times now. <laughs> Anonymous gifter. Thank you for gifting subs to Master V, Kriggs Macton. 
Mingarm. Showtime and Capex. Stuck up, half witted, scruffy looking nerfer. Thank you very, very much for that support. I do appreciate it, man. That's, that's awesome. You should not have come back. Wild Crow and Testament coming back 14 to 43 months. I ride a giant spider to the gym. It's terrifying. Thank you so much. Welcome back. Welcome back, you guys. Thank you for the, um, I don't know who did the anonymous gift. Does your name have like balls or, or Gina in it or something? Cause that might, maybe why it was, it was anonymous. Thank you so very, very much. Thank you guys. Use a hollow table on the mantis. You should do Dr. Mantis Toboggan. Okay, we got to take this back. We got to use the hollow table. You should see him feast. Thank you so much for the support, everybody. I hope you're enjoying this um, little sneak peek at uh, Star Wars. I know it's, it's coming out pretty soon for, for everybody. Yep. Oh. Nice flips, dude. Whoa. Hold on. Uh-oh. There's something up there. Stop him from moving. Hey, stop it! You're hurting Get me. You're scaring me. You're frightening me. Shakes in fear. Your defeat is assured. It's assured, bro. Ba -da -ba -da 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 -da. Death is coming for Shut you. up. You cannot break me. Stop this nonsense, trespasser. Oof. You can get them both. Yeah. Lock tight. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Thank you so much, the funniest dude on Twitch. I appreciate that, man. You should not have come back. Thank you very, very much. I break you like I break your friend. Time for a stem. Time for a stem. BD1. BD1, I've noticed, so I really like BD1 as a companion, but I have noticed that he's not nearly as funny as R2-D2. I mean, that, that, that guy is funny, dude. What the? <clears throat> R2, you rascal. That is so funny. All right, we got to use the thing. Okay, don't bug me until you give me the go ahead to get us off this planet. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta use the hollow something around Cal, it. What's up? Man? What's what'd you on? find? Nothing good. Everything that moves here is trying to kill me. It's a scary Star There's a Wars reason planet. Why no one wants to visit this desolate planet. Not everyone. I ran into this wanderer. He called himself a scholar, said he came to study Dathomir. I would be very careful, Cal. You need to be on guard against anyone seeking out the darkness of Dathomir. That was a pretty strange guy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I was on Mad TV, so I know failure. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was okay. We'll talk later. Okay, all right. <clears throat> We're gonna talk later. About Mad TV? I hope so. Take less, less block stamina. So Cal can perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. Quickly evades. Allows Cal to perform a, per, perform a kick attack. That sounds cool too. Poof. Oh, it's a little stunsky. Pa. 
You idiot. I hope that guy had a family, and I hope they miss him very much. So apparently this takes place, um, at Stunsky. Take, this takes place after episode three, I guess. Like, I think it takes place like 25 minutes after Darth Vader goes, No! It seems in your anger, you fucking killed her, bro. What? No! <clears throat> Between three and four, yeah. Uh, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, hold on. Uh, hollow map. Yeah, opens the hollow map. Let's let's check out the hollow map. Oh, we can't use the hollow map in here. There we go. It says use the hollow table on the mantis. So we definitely need to just like head out of here. I guess we're just gonna come back here later. I suppose. When your friends arrive, it will be course. quite operational. Morgano. Zepho. Mm-hmm. You know, my piloting hasn't been this good since I graduated first in my class at the Lateron Space Academy. <coughs> I wasn't aware Lateron had an academy. Can we cut the chatter? Yeah, it was new back in the day. Freckles. You probably don't Thanks, my friends. What's what's happening? So, what did you train on? Name it. Fighters, freighters, short range, long range, whatever. I flew circles around I'm at 25 minutes after he you said no. Freighters in circles. Yeah, it's all they really allowed me to do. I was so good, though, you should have seen me. Can I sit down now? I have to wait till you guys, like, talk it out before I sit down. Grab some seat, kid. I'm trying to grab some seat right now. We're about to drop out of hyperspace. Sit down. I'm trying. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Star Wars monster, get us down there right now. Oh. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh! Huh. Perfect landing. <laughs> Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. Where? We did good work on Begano. Oh, I... The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. I've heard of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. I only knew that Cordova was obsessed with the Zepho. Stream schedule is 9 p.m., six important. nights a week, 9 p.m. Pacific. I, too, was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn here. Good luck. Thank you. Also, the Mean Street shirt is back. 14 day, 14, 14 day uh, campaign happening right now. The Mean Streets, dudes. I'm, I'm after the stream, I'm picking up a couple of them. I can see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. No, it's not. But I think of those who believed in me at one point. If I give up on myself, then I give up on them. I'm sure you have a few of those. Prof, 
a friend on Braca. He sacrificed himself so I could live. He believed in you. A lot of people depend on you, even if they don't know it yet. All right. Keep going, Cal. For Prof. For everyone. I spent sixty dollars on this game. I'm definitely keep. I'm gonna keep on going. Don't worry. He wants a helpful droid. He does seem to be warming up to you. Cordova must have really liked droids. Utter decision. He yeah. decided to leave Me such too. important I gotta, information I gotta get a with BD-1. I only assume he chose BD-1 because he needed some sort of ability to store encrypted information. These exploration droids are good tools for that sort of thing. But I'm sure he's more than that. That was a fart. Please, I'm trying to collect my thoughts. Are you? Is this how you collect your thoughts? <laughs> I'm very busy. I'm just making some calibrations. No, you're not. I was just ordering some magazines. I wonder how big it'll get. I'm enjoying. I'm enjoying it very much. There's a little cowpie right there. Yeah, I wear. I wear my Mean Street shirts. Uh, I have two pairs, two two shirts. I wear them twice a week, at least. Maybe more than that if I'm feeling gross. <laughs> if I want to feel gross in my dirty shirts. So they're getting a little worse for wear. This shirt, I get more more comments on this shirt than anything I've ever worn. Good work. People are crazy oh, about we it. Did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. Smidler, I got you? this game for fifty nine dollars and eight to? cents. Uh, JB Hi-Fi, dude. My ship, the Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Oh, what do you know? You've probably never even flown a ship. Maybe I'll teach you one day when you're done with your Jedi stuff. I'll even give you a discount. Mm -hmm. If you're if you're if you're in Australia, I saw I, when I went to the mall to go to JB Hi-Fi to get my pre-order, I saw a bunch of people filing in to EB Games. It's 99 Australian dollars for a game at EB Games. If you get a, a brand new release for a game the first two days at JB Hi-Fi, it's 69 Australian or something like that, or 67. So it ends up being like 59 dollars. Oh yeah. It was 79 bucks, Midler. Yeah, I pre-ordered mine. That said, the for, for, it's running for the next two days. It's like uh, 67 or something. I've got the receipt right here. Can't get through. Hmm. Here. The game is pretty oh, good, uh, Matthias. It's pretty damn good. Blue leader? This is red leader. We found them. We found them. It's 69, yeah, yeah. When games cost twenty nine ninety nine, I rem I remember the days when uh, when Super Nintendo games cost seventy nine dollars. Like an electronic store. What is going on down here? Watch out, PD. You don't look friendly. Wow. This stormtrooper probably gave him hell, though. He didn't he didn't land a single shot, but he probably gave him hell. The Empire. They found Zeppo. Yeah, Grayson. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. Six foot five. What do you get? <laughs> I owe my soul to the company store. I got the double ender, dudes. The old double ender. Yeah, uh, greatest journey. You can actually, you can actually increase the uh, subtitle size to. I'm. At, it's at ten right now. They can go up to fifteen, and when there's more than like two people talking at once, when you're walking around like a spaceport or something, the whole entire screen is filled with text. It's pretty cool. Die, monster! Oh. 
The Skaz. Listen to that smooth Skaz. Capable of two different attacks. Okay. Or bite at a prey's heel or lock them down with a leap that cannot be blocked. Opportunistic after often surrounding prey when they are locked down. Skaz are most commonly found in the shade or dark areas where they can maintain cooler body temperatures. Due to poor vision, they are especially vulnerable in bright light. They are most dangerous in packs, often biting and locking their jaws onto prey, providing an opportunity for the others to strike. Really? They're more dangerous when there's more of them? That's... Oh, that's actually pretty Find common. something? What did you find? That smooth scans. Quite a drop there. It's the worst thing to find. Mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. They were in the rivers, Andy. Okay. This is also your light source, by the way, besides uh, BD1's crappy green light. Stim crate should be here. Yeah! Hey, can you carry more? Three stims, baby. Thanks, BD1. Thanks, buddy. You rascal. Stim canister required. <clears throat> so I'm guessing this place is probably going to be a lot easier than the, the last place that we were at. Because we were, we were supposed to come here first. We're not supposed to, but that was like part of the story. We went to the other place as an extra kind of thing. You are able to change the way you look, yeah. This is premium content poncho right here. <laughs> For the pre-order. <laughs> this is a premium content poncho. So you, you, uh, you they're like collectibles. You find them everywhere. Like little um, things to change the way your lightsaber looks, the way your clothes look. Unfortunately, you can't change the color of your hair. You're all you're doomed to look like a good guy doll for the for the rest of your life. That's okay. I can get him. Oh, try to get me, bro. You can get me. Go ahead, get me. Stop shooting yourself. Stop shooting yourself. Let's go, BD one. I can get him. Frank, I've never seen you get anything. Well, I'm going to get him. I just... Oh, okay. What do we find? A meter required duty and resolve. Duty. Nice, dude. Hey, nice. <laughs> easy, 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 easy. Uh. Look at it, look at it, look at his, look at his hands. Oh, shit. Damn it, he didn't do it. 
Oh, he will do it. Friends, friends to the end. Andy. Andy. <laughs> Damn Bella. <clears throat> Warning. This area is off limits. Imperial code 94364. No selling or trading. No soliciting. No skateboarding. Andy. <laughs> They're out of there, dude. You there. I really want to have a, <clears throat> a a lightsaber throw, dude. I want to be able to throw my lightsaber. That shit is... So cats me out. Yeah, we, 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 ah! <clears throat> we don't have anything to worry about out here. Oh, the human! Oh, shit. Bastardo. <clears throat> Dios mío, who ate my sopapilla? A piece of fabric. Oh, wait. A bag left by a family as they became separated. The father caused a distraction, allowing the mother to escape with their child. Their children. Uh, no, this is, this is, um... Where did I get this weapon? I just upgraded it at the last place. Uh, this is, uh, this is available on PC. Um, and X Cox, PS4, yeah. All the consoles that God cares about, basically. Someone's here. Yeah. Yeah. There he is, blast him. Whoa. Don't take a bunch of extra swings, dude. You're embarrassing me. Now they'll never worry again. Sleep the eternal sleep. Hi. Whoa. You guys didn't even give me a chance to put my hands in the air. What's this guy doing? Are you guys okay? Fuck you. I see you down there. Firing on the enemy. Ow. Did we did we scare you? Did we spook you? Are are you totally spooked now? Look, under us! That's not possible. Keep an eye out for him. Keep an eye out for him. Hey now. The blaster right, deflex is awesome. One. They're, he's just deflecting my shots, sir. We'll shoot more of them. Copy that. Oh. Oh shit, we're so close too. <clears throat> Gatekeeper, step away. Yeah, he's over shameless. Louis, thank you for the host. <laughs> River has it, we respawn when he when he meditates, but I don't believe a word of it. What the heck? There he is! I'll take him down. Ow. Don't let him get you! Intruder! Trying to scratch him! They will mutiny. Okay, let's go over here first. He's run away! Ow. Attacking the enemy. Ish. I see. The you Blast piece of trash. Ah, fire. <laughs> we haven't tried this little ditty here. 
Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, dude. <laughs> now he's running. Look at him. Look at this little piece of shit. Oh, I don't have any things left. We'll end this quick. You guys are idiots. Hypno Crab, what's going on, my man? How are you, dude? BD1. BD1. Mm hmm. What? <laughs> Incoming threat. Move up. Got to time it, dude. Damn it. Whoa. Okay. Well, they they definitely can hit you <laughs> if you don't time it right. Mm, the game so far is is awesome, but I guess I a little help. Uh, I I'm just a huge Star Wars fan, dude. You know, like it, it really, I knew I was gonna like this game anyway because any chance I get to to delve into the Star Wars realm, die you mother! Oh my! I see you. Take two. Die! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Do you have force pu uh, force push and choke abilities? Uh, probably later. Right now, all we have is like a slow down effect with our force. That's that's it. <laughs> You're embarrassing me, Cal. Is there a dark Dark Souls aspect? I feel like there's there's been some things that have that have they've adopted from Dark Souls, and rightfully so because that's just like the best third person action RPG combat there is. But it's very, might sound silly to say or to hear, but it's very, very Star Wars-y. It feels like you, you are a Jedi. It feels fantastic. So it's very Star Wars-y. I'm on PS4 right now, yeah. I wasn't about to push uh, Sarah's laptop to the limit. Walk along the razor's edge. Doing. Makes you feel like you're a spider man. But it feels the the combat feels really good. There's all there's a lot of different things you can do in the combat that make it feel quite immersive. As far as being a Jedi goes. I would like it is I would like to get like an actual flashlight. That'd be pretty pretty badass. Force light. Sarah's feeling a bit better, yeah. She she had to go to work today. She's been she's gonna be working for the next six days, so we've got all the damn time in the world to play this and then also finish up Death Stranding. Cool, man. Cool, dude. You can't wait to snag it this weekend? Hell yeah, it is. I picked it up this morning at 9 a.m. I was there at opening. Grabbed it up. What the? Did I? Jesus! Oh, 
Oh. Shit. Problem. That looks like a problem. Oh, Jesus. BD1, it's them. Jeez, I'm crow. Who's my who's my favorite uh, Jedi and who's who's my favorite villain? Hmm. Damn it! Wait a minute. Are we in Bronca? Data bank, tactical guides. Uh, that's, that's really, that's, that's quite tough. Hmm, <laughs> Dooku, no, no, um, I, I, I really, I really like Samuel L. Jackson. Why did, why did I forget his, his name in, in Star Wars? I was just, I was just talking about him the other day. <laughs> Cause he's got a, he's got a twitch purple lightsaber and also Mace Windu. Yeah. Also he plays Samuel L. Jackson. His name might be Mace Windu, but he plays Samuel L. Jackson. He, he's, he's, he's the same guy. So how can you not love him? And everything that, that he's in, he's just Samuel L. Jackson. He just goes by a different name. Which I love to see him in the Star Wars universe. Because he just does not fit. <laughs> yes, these Sith Lords deserve to die! Philax are masterful climbers, able to move with ease on mountain paths. Solitary by nature, they leave their mother's side early to find their own territory. The horns on their heads are their greatest weapon. When two Philax clash, the sound thunders across the mountains. As they age, their horns steadily grow, adding a new ring for each year of their lives. And I hope they burn in space hell! Say, say midichlorian one more time. <laughs> oh, God. A little help. A little freaking help over here? You know what? Damn. I really, I, I really wish we, we would have went to that one little area back there with the save points. There must have, there's probably something back there. Oh, well. No, I didn't hear anything. Jesus! Get, get the Jedi! He's really injured. Okay. Get going. I think I'm done. Blocking my blows. I'm sure we'll beat you. I can't hit him. He's got like magical powers or something. No. Whoa. Okay, this looks like it's probably gonna fall if we don't do it right. Wow! So we can't grab onto the edge of that thing. It needs to be per -per -per perfect. Jeez. The pro is performance mode, yeah. I can't wait to check it out on my pro if it if it ever gets here. I, I'm I'm pretty sure that the ship that I sh that I 
shipped all my stuff on is, is has long sunk. Damn it. It's not, it's... Come on. It, he, he's holding a thermal detonator! Really? Shit! You should shoot! Come on. Fuck. God damn it. Trying to to target and shit just whipping around the other side, that's pretty tough. What difficulty we play on hard mode? It's good. It's good. And it's actually quite tough. It's actually quite tough on this difficulty. It's actually quite tough indeed. The parry window is smaller and you take uh, way more damage from from everything. Nice. Oh, oh, dude. Uh, yes, I believe. I wanted to check this place out anyway. Oh, wait, no, this isn't even the place, but we are back where we wanted to go before, I think. Which was... On the other side, I think? I think so. Oh, there's more stuff down there, too. Would you parry? Steve Perry. Can I get back though? That's the thing. Oh my dad. Okay. Scomp Link. I'm not really sure what Scomp Links are. I don't know if we can get back to where you were before. I would love to. We might not be on the, the point of the point of no return here. Yeah, once you jump down, I think it's all over with. Oh wait, we can we can jump and, and grab onto this, can't we? Oh yeah. <clears throat> Thoughts on the Sonic movie being fixed? It's it's an animated movie, so I probably won't see it. I don't know. It just seems seems like a kid show, kind of. But I'm glad they fixed it because the before I saw the I saw on Twitter the before it looks like the kid from Jumanji when he turned into a monkey. Get down here. And that is just hideous. How's the game so far? So far, it's pretty damn good, dude. So we got to remember there is a place. To the left of this area that we need to go down into. Let's go check out this part first, though. Uh, I see you up there. Yeah, that kid from Jumanji is so ugly. It makes me want to puke. There, above us. You, get up here. Out of the way. Out of the way. I knew he would run. See you later, dickwad. All right, let's check this place out. So we didn't we didn't go any further through here. Oh, it was a it was the shorty. Okay, but it just takes us right back here. Okay. What do we find, buddy? Dude. Is there anything left out here? I think we already went up there. All right, let's go through here. We got a poncho skin. Come here, beady one. Mm. 
pretty lengthy to explore 100%. Well, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. I don't really expect this story to be to really be more than like 20 hours. That's what I was thinking. Oh yeah, we gotta go down here, don't we? Where are you taking us? The Empire's forced the villagers from their homes. Frightened refugees, shipped off to work camps. Or worse. Mad work camps, worse, worse. Right. It's all lies. The Empire just wanted this land. Of course they did. Eviction notice. Civilians must immediately report for relocation. Looters will be shot. In accordance with Imperial Code 94364, no selling or trading without proper authorization ex and explicit consent. This property and its belongings are now under the protection of the Galactic Empire. My amiibos! I left all my amiibos in there. The Jedi is here! This piece of shit! Someone get him! I can beat him! Get out of there! Jesus! Moving back! I think I did pretty well. So the 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 red shit, I'm I'm guessing that that needs a force push. That needs like a big ass force push. Dummy! All right, we're gonna get. We need. We need our, all of our heals. This is gonna be a long trip. Is it lightsaber only? I don't know. I, I'm not sure. I guess so. Damn it. There, up there. <laughs> Where did you go? No, I there's no slicing of limbs or anything. Um in 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 the classic Star Wars fashion. It's just like quite a bit of smoke. Jedi, a, a, a puff of smoke. It's pretty much what you get. Sparks. Oh, we haven't even gotten the scout trooper. Can block limited lightsaber attacks, but defense is easily diminished. Imperial scout troopers are especially trained stormtroopers, especially trained stormtroopers in service to the Galactic Empire for a range of missions. They are equipped with light armor for greater mobility and specialized helmets that allow for greater adaptability. Armed with electro ride batons, when blasters are identified as insufficient, they are especially skilled in melee combat, crowd control, defense against a lightsaber. Yeah. Didn't know this is out yet, Zapato. I picked mine up at 9 a.m., but then again, I live in the future in Australia. So one of the perks, I guess, of living in the future. How much did it cost? Uh, JB Hi-Fi always do like two days of um, specials. 
for for brand new games. So normally it's ninety nine dollars, but if you get it the first two days, it's sixty nine, which came out to be about fifty nine dollars and eight cents. So a little bit cheaper than U.S. prices. So I I, I guess uh, that's what I'll be doing from now on. Pretty badass. Mandalorian was really good. I really want to check it out. Oh yeah, they are Arlieth. I I because I because I bought Death Stranding on on uh, PSN. It cost me ninety nine dollars, which was like seventy something dollars US. <clears throat> but JB Hi-Fi, if you pick up a physical copy of it the first couple of days, it's sixty nine. Australian, which is like $59. I guess so, Zeno. Yeah. That's what, I was, that's what I've been told from Australians. Never, ever buy anything from the PSN store. Also, it takes 10 hours to download a game. And when you get a physical copy, it only took me like 13 minutes to install it. So it's a it's a win win. You're quick, good for you. This is a premium color, dude. I got this lightsaber color for uh, for pre-ordering. <laughs> yeah, it's premium, dude. My thoughts on the game so far, Stinsav. Uh, well, we've played it for three hours and 51 minutes. Two hours and some was a tutorial, so I guess the hour and a half I've played has been fantastic. But take that as you as you as you will, because it's been an hour and a half of actual gameplay. So. I'm liking it. Whoa. I can't keep track of him. Gotcha, bitch. Oh, units down. Down, 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 But I will say this, if you don't like Star Wars, you're not gonna like this game. <laughs> I get that should go without saying, but some people gotta hear it, I guess. Because it is Star Wars. That's why I say that. Damn it. Keep at it, keep at it, keep at it. Whoa, dude. Wow. Okay. Skill point acquired. Thought I died. Sure. 
shortcuts, baby. Okay. He's above us. I'm like on the I'm on the same level you are. Damn it! So you can only do, you can only deflect two lasers at once. I think. Got gotcha, you, bitch. Take the Mario 64 shortcut. Take the shot. Take the shot. Whoa. Okay. I don't know what this is all about. Oh, that looks horrible. It looks like some terrible platform shit. It says one hour instead of three. Oh, nice. I see you, you piece of shit. You dirt bag. If only we had a force jump. You get EA access on PS4. Play the best of EA games with EA access. Apparently you can. It says inside of my thing here. Eyes over there. Right. I live for the chase. I need help to kill you. Scomp link. Okay. Walk right into that fan. Remains of a villager who died trying to save his family. That was close. <laughs> wow. Let's get going, BD1. Hey, what do you say there, BD1? Wait, what was BD1 doing? Was he over here trying to check something out? He was. I can't push it. Push it. <clears throat> I guess all we have is this now. Attack after an overhead slash. Or do we already have that? Okay. Boing, 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 boing. It's, it costs two skill points to, to do that one. All right. So I guess we have to. I guess we have to. Fill up the what we have there, and then we un unlock more. Or something. How was the day one patch? I didn't even notice a patch, and I'm on Australian internet, so I guess pretty good. I guess it was pretty good. I have two. I, I need two points to 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 spend. 
for that one. I'm watching you. Dodge all you want. I'll keep Cripes. Mm, well, there's there's only one to choose from. <laughs> Save for force push. There's only one to choose from. And force push is going to be like a Metroidvania type skill because we need to use it to unlock different areas. So if we got it now, um, it wouldn't make any sense because we're not supposed to have it now. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Wow. Cool. Well, we got to take the whole goddamn thing. Necro, no way, dude. Drugs are fucking awesome. <laughs> drugs are fantastic. Of course, uh, I haven't been able to afford drugs since I was in my 20s. It was far too expensive. I'm guessing it's probably going to be... Uh, able, you'll be able to throw it eventually. Nero! Enjoy the golden creek. Thank you so very much. Here you go. Tier two for the 32 months. Welcome back, my friend. Thank you so very, very much. Appreciate you, dude. Appreciate you, man. Come back. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. How are you, Something dude? We can use. Oh, wow. The new light lightsaber sleeve. Uh -huh. Ugh. Star Wars is going pretty good, man. I've been digging it. We're about four, we're about four hours into it, so not uh, not too far yet. I'm having a good time. I'm gonna embarrass you, Barry. Yeah. Why don't you marry him? You hate it so much. Why don't you marry him? Take a quick rest here. Quick rest, Arena, and uh, I will take a quick rest as well. Stick around, guys. Don't go anywhere. I will be right back. Thank you so very, very much for the support. Uh, let me play some music for y'all. Oh, yeah. This is a good one. Uh, thanks for hanging out today. I know pretty soon there's going to be a million trillion people playing this game. Thank you for, for sticking around and, and watching me play it. At least for a little while. Make sure you hit the follow button. Before you take off, you're going to take off. I only take like a two-minute break. I just got to go to the bathroom, make sure I have some water. Also, the merchandise store. This, the Mean Streets, is back for 14 days. Exclamation point, merch. Get yourself a, a, a Mean Streets, dude. I'm getting, I'm going to buy two more of these. I already have two. Thank you guys for being here. I'll be right back. Stick around. Don't go anywhere. Thank you. Good morning, Melgore. You're not part of the turbo team.
Yo, Crow, you just got one. Nice, dude. Thank you, man. Thank you, my brother. I'm excited to get a couple more. This one's this one's getting pretty old. Thank you for sticking around, guys. Got some water in my cup. Thank you. The pre-order as well. It's been years since I pre-ordered something, but the pre-order came with this too, which uh, I'm old. I'm in my 30s now, so I'm really into um, framing stuff. So I might just frame this up, just because. I was just about to. I was just about to leave. <laughs> yeah, dude. The days of me sticking posters with clear tape on the wall have long since passed mm. right over the porcelain throne you know what I have what I usually have over my porcelain throne is my um, purity ring 2016 frame uh, or uh, poster from their from their 2016 tour that I got one, at one of their shows it's a beautiful beautiful uh, poster it's, it's quite lovely cool <laughs> you have to frame Roger Rabbit. Teenagers do that. Yeah, well, I still have a lot of my posters from when I was a teenager, and they have, like, just tape just stuck to the corners of it, just all ripped up, shitty. A dream catcher for my constipation. Ah! Oh, wait. Damn it! We have to... We gotta do the thing. I racked up 100% accuracy on target practice, he says. Did you? Wow. Oh yes, crazy man. I got a sample. Oh, I got one, dude. I was I wasn't gonna I wasn't about to sell any shirts with my brand on it unless they were good shirts, and they are fucking awesome. They are very, very good. I will say that the sweater, not the hooded sweater, but the regular sweatshirt doesn't fit me super great. It's a little a little bit um Strange fitting, but the shirts are unbelievably nice. They're better than Teespring. They're better than Teespring. But I've got a cartoon character body. I see you down there. Whoa! I see you, piece of shit. Yeah. Oh. The game is good, yeah. The game's a lot of fun. You have to enjoy Star Wars to I'll enjoy this game, though, I think. What size am I wearing? Uh, this is a large. I usually... It's a little bit big on me. I usually wear a medium, but... I'm... Like I said, I'm like a cartoon character. I'm in between a large and a medium. I know, Zabato. I know. It's disgusting. I'm a Marge. You tell him large Marge sent you. The Reese's Pumpkins, they're just too good, dude. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Meanwhile, more stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token outpost to keep scavengers from stealing our technology. No, Yo Crow. They won't have the Twitch hoodie, uh, the Twitch logo on the on the sleeve because I'd be sued. I'd I'd be so sued, my my socks would fly out the window. <clears throat> Unfortunately, they will not have that. Uh, Project Augur, in accordance with the Emperor's will, we've occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics. Project Augur. Uh, yeah, okay, so he just said all that stuff. Oh yeah, you can't you can't even put the you can't even put the Twitch uh, logo on your business cards. 
and I see a lot of people doing that. Actually, uh, when Retro Gaijin made his very first ever business cards, um, was like years ago. He he showed me one. We were hanging out at like a convention. He showed me one. I was like, "Ooh, you should probably get these reprinted, dude. It's not good. They will sue your ass straight to hell." Camera. Need a stem. <laughs> yeah, they try. They the Twitch tries to put a stop of all that bootleg Twitch stuff, but there's just so much out there. It's hard to it's hard to take it all down. Hey. Did you find something, BD one? Mother God. Apers. Might just switch on it, yeah, because Teespring, Teespring has the uh, has a has a thing with Twitch where they pay money to uh, to get the Twitch logo on there. That's the, when you do Teespring shirts, it goes through uh, their bank account as well. It passes through Twitch's hands too. Ouch. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. Get up there, you idiot. Oh my god. Seems very, very tough to do this. There we go. Cal, the Empire's pinpointed your location. You need to move fast. Oh, have they? Thanks. Because they've been shooting at me the entire time. Did nobody radio in, or is that... Okay. Hey. Over here. Shoot at me so I can level up. Don't scare me. Hey, an intruder. Hey, what the heck? Can I go back? I can't. Damn it. I don't need help to kill you. I really want to level up. Blocking everything. I think I'm done. What? Where'd you go? Yeah. 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 The voice acting in this game seems very mediocre. Well, they're clones. You know, like, gotta give him a break. Hey, now. 
What was in there? What was in there? I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot. There's. There's no. I don't have any force pull. No force push. That all that stuff is later in the game. I'm sure. All I have is slow down time. All I have is a head full of red hair and slow down time. What the heck? What, what did I get stuck on? Camera. Oopsie daisy. Don't touch the wall, you idiot. Take the, take the penguin shortcut. There we go. I found something. What do they know? No mention of Cordova. I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage. For now. For now. There's something down there. Well, it looked like there was something down there. Maybe just a glowy, a glowy spot. today, Buster. Whoa! Give me a break! <laughs> what Tulsa. the... What the fuck? <laughs> what happened to that guy? Sometimes the camera angles can get a little crazy, though, especially when you're trying to um, put put your targeting on something, like, and then it flips you around. But I guess that's the same thing as is, is, is a lot of games like this. That's interesting. We're on the right track. Are we? Can't get through. Yeah. Can't get through. Gotta use the push. Gotta use that push, buddy. Can't get through yet. Gotta do more game stuff. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something pulling me there, beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the Force sharpen your instincts. Okay, yeah, 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 All sure, right. sure. Something, something, the Force, got it, got it. <clears throat> it is coming out, it's coming out very soon. Or, or maybe it already is out. It's, it's definitely out in Australia's. Yeah. Okay. Get the force of Diet Coke. <laughs> What's he saying? He says there's a storm coming. I know. I know. He says if you don't give him five dollars for the photograph, his father will beat him. Huh. Another one of these. I know. Wonder if they connect. I wonder if they freaking connect, dude. I wonder if they connect four. <laughs> You better get out of there. Did 
mean, I fucking love Star Wars. I mean, I grew up, I grew up watching Star Wars, and I'm sure a lot of people in here did. So whenever there's Star Wars, I'm gonna like it. Hey, something we can use? <laughs> My mom saw Star the Episode Four when it released in theater, and I am so jelly. One. Need one of those. You gotta come down here. You gotta use the stairs. Check in the mechanics, dude. You. Okay. Do not want to try Throw to parry it. that. So these connect. A new hope, a new pope. BD1, over here. Ugh. seen a storm do that before yeah it's incredible it's pretty incredible I feel like I'm getting blown away if I go out there ouch watch this watch the stick Marvel's on stream. I'm in the tomb. <clears throat> yeah, we've uh, Widowmaker. Yeah, we've we played here. We played all the uh, Wolfenstein's on stream. Still not sure what I'm supposed to find. He's a little eccentric. How far are we? Tell Four and a half hours in. But he wouldn't send us here for his amusement. Keep an open mind. Hey, the storm. Crew travel to the Zepho homeworld. The Zepho homeworld, searching for the tombs Cordova mentioned. They learn the Empire occupied Zepho in order to mine ancient artifacts. The directive, uh, codenamed Project Augur, was terminated after Zepho's magnetic winds proved too difficult to deal with. Now Cal and BD find themselves inside an ancient Zepho tomb, looking for messages from Cordova. Oh. 
So I'm guessing we get the force push here. We must get the force push. <clears throat> in a, in a, in a, in a, you see that? In a few. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Push the ball directly into another Lucas, uh, <laughs> Lucas film. Tight squidges. Avoid contact. Moving carefully around Central Pond. Explosive core may be utilized as a defense against other enemies. Skungus among us are parasitic plant-like organisms containing explosive toxic spores, which may detonate when a threat approaches. Smaller pods burrow underground in clusters to com comprise a larger central hive known for their putrid smell and soft brain-like tissue. Various forms of this invasive species exist. Don't touch it. That's exactly what I want. Hey, BD one. You sneaky bastard. Get out of it. No, you piece of dog shit. Long-haired band long hair bandanas in revolt. Rock flag and eagle. I see. Whoa! I just bust that open. It's not just wind rippling through these chimes. Voices. In the past? Worship. Set of wind chimes left behind. There we go. Ooh. No, dude. I'll take my, I'll take my time. These were used in Zeppo meditation rituals. I think they were training force users. Hmm, Zeppo meditation relic used in an ancient rituals to train force users. Okay. That was a du the double, the double, double. Sweet. The BD one trying to backseat me. That's expensive. We were just at uh, Darth Maul's home planet, actually. 
There's a bunch of those horny bastards. Darth Mullet. <clears throat> okay. Sensing some sort of a boss fight here. We're walking up this thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was wacky. Oh, there's a big there's a big scary guy down here. Okay, well we can't grab onto those. Or maybe we can grab maybe we, we just can't be they can't, can't be moving. Okay, they can't be moving. not walk off the edge, dude. There's a scary guy. Zoop. I feel like this is this is like an uncharted like a Star Wars uncharted. It feels like almost. <laughs> Take 2. You're really out of control, dude. Oof. It's forced nice. <laughs> well done. Some sort of special thing down there, though. I want that special thing. Looks like we're gonna have to just jump from over here. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Wow. Watch out! Watch out! Lightsaber can't solve everything. Oh. 
Oh, I see. Guardian. <clears throat> Strong, slow, and protected by a central power core. When glowing power core may be removed with external force and careful s skill, allowing a critical attack on the Guardian. An ancient auto automaton constructed by the Zepho. It is be believed the Tomb Guardian's central function was to protect sacred sites, as details of their abilities remain mysterious. If encountered, one should proceed with extreme caution. Cold and indifferent, they attack not out of malice or defense, but from a programmed response to intruders. It can't be bargained with. It can't be reasoned with. Hmm. Known for powerful unblockable strikes, they can prove especially threatening in limited areas without space to dodge their attack. Their primary vulnerability appears to be the power core located above their central abdomen. Any disruption of the core should provoke a shutdown. It doesn't feel fear. Or pity or remorse. <laughs> Coromata, I, I got swole. Yeah, awesome, dude. I've been, I've been, I've been working out six days a week, man. I've, I've been, uh, I've been really hitting it hard. I spend like an hour and a half or two hours at the gym every morning. I know, I know. I'm one of those guys. Like, we get it, dude. You work out. It was either that or I remain a uh, Yukon gold potato for the remainder of my days. It absolutely will not stop, ever. You are dead. Talk about weights more, streamer. Here, the thing is about weights, they're heavy. Appreciate it, dude. We're working hard. Whoa. Mm hmm. Oh, God. Even lift, bruh. Hmm. Okay, so we, we just have to carry ourselves from the other side. I was thinking it was going to, like, be kind of tricky. But I guess we just have to do the norm, eh? We have to do the, do the Bartman. Do the Bart man. Whoa, my frames. You're breaking all those frames, dude. I can bench you out, bro. Check it out. Mm. <laughs> it got me in for the sound effects. I'm like uh, Twitch's Michael Winslow, except not nearly as good. These statues were carved from the natural cavern walls. They depict Zepho holding spheres, possibly the same kind used to power their tombs, or there there could be meatballs too. Uh, there's a little bit of dropping, Mr. Whiskey Richard. Not not really too bad. Um, but yeah, this is just my my crappy old PS4. PS4 Loser Edition. 
but uh, yeah, it's it's all right. It's not too bad. I still haven't gotten my PS4 Pro in the, in in the sh in the mail. Off the boat. Fresh off the boat. Uh, I, I really like the game because it's, it's Star Wars. The gameplay is solid. It's, it's a little it's a little hokey, you know. It's a little silly, but that's Star Wars now. They said my stuff was supposed to arrive on the twelfth, but I didn't know that they meant it was going to arrive in this country. So, I guess my stuff is here, but it needs to go through a painful and very expensive, on top of the $3,000-something dollars I paid for the shipping, a very expensive customs process that I need to pay for now, and I have to wait even longer. So, hopefully next month I'll have my shit, I don't know. Yeah. What can you do? Jesus! So basically they're just holding my stuff for ransom. I feel, I feel like a less racist Mel Gibson right now. Jesus! Focus. The Jedi do not seek aggression, but we stand against it. The Force is there to shield us. The obstacles in your path define the path. What stands in the way becomes the way. Now, try again. Use the Force to Hold on, I'm not even ready, dude. That was so mean. I'm your child. Boink. Continue. Faster now. Faster, faster, faster. Push the ball before it reaches you. Okay. I got I, 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 do over, do over. I got I, I got it this time. So don't wait until it turns blue. Just just hit it. There you go, it's turning blue now. It stands in the way. Quit playing with your the dinghy. Way. There we go. So now we can push them shits. Hey. Hey, is this a secret area? Or is this the way we gotta go? Hold on a second. I did it. They freaking did it, dude. I guess this is the way to go. My friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. The distinctive striations. It can only be a rosha tree from Kashyyyk. It's time to call on an old friend. If this Zepho had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarful will know about it. $3,000 shipping, yeah, but my my Herman Miller chair, my computer chair alone is $700. Not to mention my very, very extensive and very tough to find um, collection of, of old consoles and video games. That's pretty much the most important thing. <clears throat> Influences from Kashyyyk. During his exploration on Zepho, Master Cordova uncovered a temple dedicated to the sage Isle Ram. This exploration revealed further mysteries of the ancient culture, including their fascination with Kashyyyk, the homeworld of the Wookiee civilization. Curious to learn more, Cordova's path took him to Kashyyyk, where he sought wisdom from his old friend and Wookiee chieftain, Tarful. <clears throat> yeah, all those old systems and all, you know, my, you know, 80 Super Nintendo games, some of them being very, very rare. Fuck you!
did it all for the Wookiee. Not to mention my vintage porn collection, yeah. Good job. The more pubic hair the, 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 the actors have, the more expensive it is. Hmm. Stream some Super NES. I have a Black Magic card that I'd have to hook up to the um, the RCA cables, but it's very very hard to use that Black Magic card. You need you need to be a wizard to figure out that Black Magic capture card. This ancient Zepho sarcophagus holds the remains of Sage Ilram. They were the first of the Zepho to establish a relationship with the inhabitants of Kashyyyk and loved the planet's greenery dearly. Now their remains are forever interned beneath the roots of a stone rusher tree. Rusher. Oh, we don't want to go that way yet. We got to go do this secret, special secret thing. Do 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 do. I see. This guardian was destroyed long ago. Ooh. Hey now. Did you find something, BD1? Anybody need me, anyone? Is that a tomb guardian powerful automatons? Protect their tombs, which destroyed here long ago. Go, man, go. What the, what the, who, what? All oh, right, okay, this is just back where we were before. Got it. That's BD1, our, our little buddy. He's, um... He's a good guy. Once you get past all the all the racist remarks, of course he's speaking in droid. I understand what he's saying, but most of them are just jokes. Most of them, the blatant racism. New skills are available, baby. Nice. Oh my god. It recovers additional life when using a stim canister. Maximum life is increased. Regains more force when he defeats an enemy and regains some force when he hits a blocking enemy. Holding push allows Cal to push groups of enemies and stagger large enemies. Forces increased. For a longer duration. Yes, 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 yes. Waiting longer to press attack after Cal swings lightsaber allows him to perform a special attack with increased range. Fight! Okay. I could just imagine like a lightsaber kid doing this in his backyard. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Deflects blaster bolts while he is sprinting or while running. Wow, that's pretty good too. So let's uh let's start it off with this, I guess. Maximum life increased. Whoa.
Get out of it. Okay. It's kind of stuck in the animation there, buddy. Sorry, I was a little I was a little bit distracted. Yeah, we don't we don't really um, tolerate hate speech in here, man. Sorry about that, dude. Actually, I'm not sorry. <laughs> we don't really like people hating on uh, people for for no reason. So you gotta you gotta have to find a different stream that tolerates that kind of stuff. <clears throat> Nero, no worries, man. No worries. <sighs> Don't worry about it. Alright, All right, let's do this for real now. Nice kicks, bro. Sick kicks, man. What? Hey. Okay. So if you're laying down, that shit, that shit gets you. Whoa. So no, no dodging out of that. This game is giving off that mystery science theater vibe. Yeah, kind of. I can see that. Find door number one, dude. Hmm. Camera one, camera two. I see. Okay, we're gonna have to launch this shit, probably. Something with launching. Elspeth! Oh, baby! Elspeth, thank you so very much for the love. You guys don't know Elspeth. She's one of my good, good friends. You gotta go check her out. She's amazing. Trunks up! Thank you so very much, guys, for coming on through. We're, we're uh, playing this brand new game. We're about five hours into it. If you don't want anything spoiled for you, probably shouldn't watch. We are about five hours into the game because I live in the future, so I got a little bit earlier. Oh my goodness. Thank you so very, very much. What's cracking, guys? What's up? What were you guys doing over at uh, Elspeth's channel besides having a fantastical time? A fantastical time. Does it run well? Yeah, I'm playing this on my old uh, PS4, the Pathetic Loser Edition. Civ 5, nice. That should work. If my my bot is on or not. Super unhappy fun time right on. Yo. <clears throat> ah, okay. So we gotta we gotta whip this bitch around the other side, huh? Oh, I see. Mm 
Darth Ivan, what's going on, my man? How are you? There's a lot of great games right now. Truth. Boom! Oh, I don't want your goddamn hint, BD1. Put a cork in it, sir. So we need some... Yeah! Oh, wow. Okay. Well, <laughs> I guess... No! I guess that did it. Maybe we gotta take the other one now, or something. We need to get one all the way up yonder, dude. All the way up yonder. <clears throat> uh, Zapato, we are at the pretty much the very end of of, uh, of Death Stranding. I've got to, I gotta finish that up, man. I still gotta finish that son of a bitch up. Oh, I see. Okay. So this, oh, it opened up a passageway down this way. Yes, it did. Okay, good, 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 good. Cool, 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 cool. That one needs... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Do we have another one? Do we have another one of those somewhere? I'm just playing with my balls now. Go! Oh! Oh, we don't want to take that one out. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and make... Let's, let's go down here and just see. Let's just see what's down here first. Here we go. Here we go. That's something. This is something. This is nothing. There must be another ball. Can we get this ball out of there? Oh, we gotta bust this open? I see. Okay. It's a lot, it's a lot like Uncharted. Very uncharted. Nice, dude. That's what I'm talking about. It's like Star Wars Uncharted. I've been having a great time with it, though, because I love Star Wars. If you love Star Wars, I, I'm pretty sure you'll have a great time with this. Get over there. Here we go. It's going up. It's coming around. There it goes. Oh shit. Okay. So it's got it's got to make its rounds. It's got to make its rounds. Whoa. That was close. Haha. Go get him, buddy. Go get him. We did it. I, th I think. Is that what was supposed to happen? What did you find? The Zephyr went to Kashyyyk. Cordova mentioned someone named Tarful. Ah, a Wookiee chieftain. They were old friends. 
Think he's still around? There's only one way to find out. We have to go to Kashyyyk. We've got to go to Kashyyyk. In the eye of the storm. In the eye of an enormous storm, Cal and BD-1 found the tomb of Elrim. Inside, Cal saw a vision of his former master, Jaro Tapal, which helped him rediscover his ability to push objects with the Force. As they were leaving, Cal and BD found another hollow from Cordova pointing them to Kashyyyk. Mother! What's going on, Mom? It's good to see you. Uh, did you guys have a good Thanksgiving? Has it been Thanksgiving yet? They don't do Thanksgiving here. Has it been Thanksgiving? I don't know. Mother! End of the month. Okay. <clears throat> I don't... I don't know. I don't... I don't know. I don't know when... When, uh, when things are. I never know. Not yet. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to give you guys a call. And, uh, see how, how it's going. So we gotta get our ass. Just open the way for the Empire. <laughs> we gotta get our asses back to the to the thing. <laughs> My god, this is gonna be such a long way. Whoa. What the hell? Wonder what that was. <laughs> I, I wonder what that was, dude. What was that? What happened? Time to reload. Yeah, Fuck you. Ah. Give me a break with those rockets. Help, Stim. <laughs> hey, now. So, what was in there? So you can only you can only reflect. Two. Cripes. Die, replacement friend! Oh, what? Where's my plunge, dude? Gotcha. Kashyyyk, the jungle planet, machine planets, resort planets, yeah. I love them. I love, I love everything Star Wars. I do. I'll get you, you piece of shit. What is this now? Oh, yes, the force push. Yes, 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 yes. We just got the force push. Feeling pretty pushy. That was not Steve, you piece of shit. Wow. That is, that's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. Thank you. Stim, no. You won't escape me. I'm a stormtrooper. I went to an online course for this. I don't think I can reflect a rocket. I took an online course. I'm in the, I'm in the grass. Okay, looks like we cannot do that. Looks like we're gonna have to go the other side. Hwa! Okay, so he must have killed himself with the rocket. That's classic stormtrooper. Uh. <clears throat> um. Is it, this this game takes place in between the third and fourth episode? Yeah. So it's like the game begins like about a half an hour after Darth Vader goes no, and then continues on from there. 
adventure I ensues past that point. Dort! The drones, dude. Ow! This guy's fast. There we go. Not expecting that. I really need a stem. Ho! down here. Duty. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the guy that we're listening to right now, we were actually just like listening into his conversation. He's like, so uh, target practice, I scored 100% on all my targets. Then I, then I chopped his head off. Hey, what the? Damn it. I'm pretty sure it's a good. I'm pretty sure it's a good guy thing. You just, you just, you're always going to be a good guy, and and ironically enough, you are. You will always look like a good guy doll, as well. Andy, Andy. Fuck you. It's all over now. We're friends to the end. Can you? I did it. He did it. He hit me. It's only because I suck. This looks interesting. God, I'm in the rocks, dude. Oof. Oof. I wasn't expecting this. It's a giant Zepho statue. Kind of thought there would be Zepho stuff inside. I'm playing on PS4 because I do not trust EA enough to uh, to to purchase a full price game on on uh, on PC. I did want to spend you know four hours of the stream troubleshooting why my game is working like a piece of shit. So, but that's just me. I'm not saying you guys will have those problems. I most certainly will. I always do. You're doing great. You're doing great. Acquire upgrade, dude. What's Stomping? up, Starbuck? Yeah, you're right. I think I could replace yours with this. Let's get you fixed up. I'm thinking the gameplay is is fun. It's it's very immersive as far as being a Jedi is concerned. Feels very very immersive. Try it out. What about your tools? <laughs> Slice panels and access new areas. Oh my dear lord! Well, we did get some stuff to customize a lightsaber. We do have this premium content, bro. I did pre-order. So, uh, we got the poster, dude. <laughs> we, got, we got the poster and the orange lightsaber and all kinds of stuff. I don't know. I, I, I really, I never pre-ordered, but I figured it, I'd pre-order this. Because I didn't want them to run out of copies. No Cordova. It's kind of cool. Oh, yeah. It's pretty sweet, too. Like that. Sure, why not? Should we switch to green just to just to give it a go? <clears throat> it's cosmetic only, yeah. Uh, you should not come back. Further. Thank you so very much for the 18 months. Appreciate that. Welcome back, my friend. Slice it. Not further. Uh, 
there's no character creation or lightsaber choice at the beginning, but you do have a choice between like some basic stuff. Like you can have green or blue or orange if you get the pre-order or whatever. Hang the poster on the ceiling by my bed. Or pr I'm gonna practice kissing on it. I'm gonna practice kissing on this poster so that I'm I'm ready for the real thing. I see you down there. Well, that didn't work out. What was your plan there? Further, I'm doing very well, dude. Very excited to play this game. Been having a blast. We're about five five hours into the game. I saved my first kiss for marriage, yeah. And when it happened, dude, it was scary, dude. It was scary. Seen, seen a vagina. I've seen Sarah's vagina one time, and it well, I didn't know what to make of it. But I get to see naked boobs on the reg. So. I gotta say, I don't know. I didn't know what to make of it. <laughs> hey! Oh! Like a deer in the headlight. Hey, there he goes. Okay, so maybe a double, a double, double trouble. There we go. Take two, take two, take two. Oh, I see. Okay. Pretty clever. Pretty clever, dudes. That's why they put this here. I went up here when we first got here. I was like, why the hell did they put that there? Hey, what'd you, what'd you see over there? There they are. Blast them. He's really flipping around. So, so sometimes, ow! Sometimes the uh, <laughs> the the, uh, the plunge attack. The it's not so plungy as it is folly. It's more folly than it is plungy. Do not. Whoa! Hey, what the hell? We're this. What are you doing? Great, 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 great. No. That's perfect. Oh, no. He's dodging fast. Oh no. Oh no no no. I cannot keep up with this camera. Hurry. You there, sir. It's much better. I like how a lot of the stormtroopers they just they just say, I'm done. Yep, I'm done. Got a scan? My friend, in the rotation since I left Pagano, I've uncovered more about the Zeth I just changed it to I green just to see what possible. it was like. And it is very green. That's that's the truth, dude. Okay, so we do need to go through here. Super green. Let's go to Kashyyyk. 
Hopefully my frames can handle Kashyyyk. It sounds very foresty. Because it is. Great. Okay, so there, I believe there is a breakable wall. Is there a breakable wall through here? What the hell is this thing? Oh, we gotta push that bitch down. Yeah, that's right. We gotta push it down. Jedi, huh? Right. Wait, just time out. Time out. <laughs> oh, So the, yeah, it's it's a lot like uh, Star Wars Tomb Raider or or, or Star Wars uh, Uncharted kind of. We didn't stand a chance. Eyes over there. Back up. I've got this. Hey, I've got this. He says. All right, buddy. Move in. That guy just died. I didn't even mean to kill him. I see. Oh, you know what? There is a thing over here, too. I'm done. We got our new thing here. There we go. Thanks. Something we can use? A new lightsaber material. Okay. Are we able to, to hop on this thing, or is that... Yay! Okay, I was thinking that we wouldn't be able to do that. Great. Can I push this guy off the edge, you think? Oh, yes, sir! I haven't even tried that. It's fantastic. Pretty badass, dude. Wait, wait, isn't there... I think there's a little entrance here somewhere. Uh, why are we even still here? There's nothing on this planet. Maybe there's some historic artifacts or something. I mean, we are digging. We are digging. We already heard that when he rests at a meditation spot. We all respawn, but I don't believe a word of it. There he is, blast him. Come again. I didn't I didn't copy. Oh my god. Shit. I need help. You need to, you need to heal up. What you need to do. Oh, the electricity. Stim, now. Door. <laughs> Give me a break, dude. No. 
Jesus. Hurry. No. I did change my lightsaber color just to give it a give it a give it a try. Fuck you. <laughs> All terrain scout transport ATST. Also known as a scout walker, is a lightweight bipedal two person transport deployed for ground force support in the Galactic Empire. They were often used for swift reconnaissance and targeting smaller threats that evaded the, the larger ATATs, the AT ATs. Equipped with chin mounted medium blaster cannons capable of firing at a range of two clicks, as well as side cannons armed with rockets and concussion grenades targeting enemy vehicles and ground troops at close range. Actually, it's pronounced. Uh, <laughs> mounted medium blaster cannons? I'm surprised you didn't know that. Nice work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just <laughs> tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of the Ah, space Sage. monster! They definitely use the force. An advanced civilization of force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zeppo journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Yeah, Colin. Sheik, I, look, Not too bad for hard really mode. bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Ugh. She got the Bushimi eyes. I, I think know. this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the force? Yes, with the force. With the horse. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Actually, I have like seven I times. I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the force? When the purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan, Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings. But they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about. I know her from Mad TV. Cordova. <laughs> that's where, that's where, I, where I know her and from. where he went. But you escaped. No. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. What's up, Joshy? But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. I know you've been through some terrible shit in your life. I get that. I mean, you're on Mad TV, for God's sakes. I'm so sorry. Give me a minute. I'm siphoning Imperial data. Here's a big message. <laughs> I can't even read it. It's going way too fast. <laughs> wowie, zowie. Hey, 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 hey. <clears throat> Is this is this is this uh Mr. Mr. W Shant here? Is it a is it platypus? No, it is not. He was just in here. At the Duka Duka War. I love Duka Duka. Get scracked. <laughs> <What is that? laughs> platypus, what's up, man? 
Thank you so much for this raid, dude. I appreciate it. Sir, smoke a lot. How are you? How is everybody? Thank you for coming on in. We're playing, um... We're playing, we're playing the new Tetris online. It's really big. It's probably marbles on stream right now. Checking out this new Star Wars. <clears throat> so far, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty good. So far, it's all right. Uh, I'm, I love Star Wars, so of course I'm going to enjoy it. This new Tetris is complicated as shit. I can never get a long piece. I always get the lady from Mad TV. Okay, customize lightsaber. Uh, Tetris 99. You know what I really... You know what Tetris game I fucking loved? Was Tetrisphere. From, uh... On, on, on N64. Tetrisphere was the shit. That was really the only... Yeah, you and me, we're unstoppable. You're a monster. Don't you think, kid, huh? The man is in graves every time... Luke Maker, what's up? Landing. That Subba, how are you? you? Say that. If you guys don't know Platypus, go follow him up. ship before? No, mostly just scrapper transports and Braca. Oh, kid. You gotta get in the cockpit. You ever put sometime. your finger inside of a Star Feel Wars the monster? in your hands and the galaxy in your grasp. Oh, it's unbelievable. Sounds good. Let me know when. Huh? No, not mine. Not the Manus. No way. I'm just saying you should try it sometime, but with someone else's ship. Oh God. What's up, Grease? Remember that Scout Walker you took down? The ATST? No, I don't. Yeah. Oh yeah, the one I just did. Personal, right? What are you getting at, Grease? How's about you? Oh, I read the copy paste. One of those things from the Empire, and I take it for a spin. Oh, I have got the. Help me out next time we're in a fight. I've always thought that what? I'm kind no, of a Jedi no because way. I have this thing where it's I can read just in my head. Get, forget I said anything. There's a very small percentage of the population out there that can do that. It's pretty tricky. It, it was it was huge. It was massive. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it very very much. I did. Thank you. So very, very much <laughs> for that, for that very lengthy, uh, message. I read it, I read it inside of my head. I know it's super hard to believe. I get it. There was mention of Dukkha Dukkha, which is one of my favorite seasonings. So I've, I, you had me at Dukkha Dukkha. Cordova had supplies hidden all over Bagano. Could be worth a trip back to explore. What? Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's probably a good idea. You're right. You're right. You're right. Bagano. Bagano. You like a, You want a spaghetti massage? Okay, we should probably go back to Bagano, huh? Maybe? Go check out Bagano? Oh, yeah. Is there? I don't know if there is or not. Oh, you know what? There might be. There might be some stuff to go to, 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 in Bagano. Bagano, here we come. Monster brand energy. So, if the order thing is rebuilt, you think any Jedi will come out of hiding? Mm, what makes you think there are a Jedi hiding? No, I'm just curious. Is there someone? Back. Glitch penguin. Thank you so very much. Well, Don't listen to Vader. Thank you for coming back. The three months. Legendary Jedi master and. Are you talking about Master Yoda? Welcome back. Yes. Are you talking about Master Baiting? Very legendary. Wait, what? Who? No, no. I'm talking about Master Yaddle. The Jedi High Council member? No way. Yeah, we all have our dreams, okay? <laughs> Let me have mine. <laughs> no problem. I don't know if somebody's actually here or the... Uh, or We're the, about to drop out of hyperspace. Or the, the dogs are just freaking out. Glitch Penguin, thank you so much for doing that. I do appreciate that. I do indeed. Platypus, have a wonderful night, dude. We'll see you later. Thank you so much for this love. I do appreciate it. We'll see you very soon. Bogano, you want a spaghetti massage? So I'm, I'm guessing there's gonna be some extra stuff here. My frames, my frames. You're making good progress, Cal. Thanks, Mad TV lady. I'm Appreciate glad you. you're with us. We got a galaxy to save. Not an easy task. Are you sure you're up to it? I'll be okay. 
fairer than hiding on Braca. I've been to many different planets Chopping and galaxies broccoli. searching for... Well, you. Unless we stop the Empire, we'll all be gone. Hidden or not. I'm ready. Good. I'm super ready. I'm very, very... I'm super ready, dude. Do it again. Must have come here a lot with Cordova. No. Actually, he never brought me here. He did tell me about it. I was the only one who knew of its location. He trusted you. I suppose he did. He trusted I'd believe him and finish what he started. Mm. Hopefully he was right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. BD1 thinks so. No. Oh, oh one BD1. <laughs> you rascal. Hey, that was racist, BD1. Take it back. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry about that. <clears throat> okay, hold on a second. Let me go see if I can change my quiet. outfit. Too quiet. Not a fan of nature, Grease? Hold that thought. Just wait, just, 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 just hold on. Can I, can I do, so this is just light, lightsaber stuff. I think this is just a lightsaber. I'd like to change my, my outfit. Cause I've got, I'm going back, to, I'm going back to the premium content, dude. Premium content. Yes, we know it works, dude. Thank you. Uh, how do I change my poncho, dude? I want to get my, my poncho on. So you and Sierra have been here a few times. Oh, we've been all over the place. Non-stop tour of the galaxy with her. But she's paying the bills, so I can't complain, really. <laughs> we had a BB, yeah, now we got a BD. Scrapyard for years. <laughs> oh, that I can agree with. I mean, I've seen trash heaps before. And that planet was the trashiest. I can't believe anyone would... Sorry. You're not wrong. I, I think I'll start calling BD-1 BD Wong. Uh, one, of my one of my favorite actors from uh, Law and Order Special Victims Unit. He's like the Asian guy who's like smart and stuff. That's Hurry a good up neighbor. here, I'm hungry. Might try a new recipe for smoked kadu ribs. Okay, calm down. What do you think about that, BD Wong? Or we can just skip all, skip the entire cast and just go straight to Dick Wolf. Hold on now. I thought there was a way to change my, my goddamn outfit. Also, the scientist in Jurassic Park, yeah. Yes, he is. So this place doesn't, this place doesn't like my, my uh, pathetic loser edition of PS4. BD1. BD Wong. Oh, do you want me to check something out over here? Is that what you wanted? Is this what you want? Is that what gets you off, dude? Is this what gets you off, bro? Oh, it's press pause or poncho. Okay, nice. Customization, you're right, you're right. Boggling tunnels connect their nests and serve as a natural defense against predators. Able to dig five meters per day, bogglings collaborate in heckles or large packs, spending approximately one-third of their lives span digging the intricate tunnel network. Mm -hmm. Oh, neat! Oh my god, BD. You got stuff too? Premium content, BD? Sure. I got that premium content Mantis. Dr. Mantis Toboggan. Now that's pretty boss hoss. Why don't you check out that poncho, son? My my textures. Hey, look at that. Look at you look at you now. Look how good you're doing. <clears throat> Yeah, we, I mean, we changed the outfit earlier, so I knew that we could. Ooh, we switched to the premium content, man. It's so premium, too. Do you see how freaking premium that poncho was? Oh, my God. You can't even, you can't even believe it. You should not have come back. Karis, thank you for 59 months, as long as you could be subbed here, dude. Thank you so very much, dude. Wowie, wowie, zowie. Holy wowie, zowie. Can you change the face? No, we will forever look like a good guy doll. That is our that is our curse. That, my friend, is our curse. Ugh. 
Whoa. Yeah, this this uh, this place really does not like my pathetic loser edition of PS4. Thank you, Karis. Appreciate that, dude. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I don't think we've ever been down there. So this is the this is like the starter place. This is where you started off at. But we haven't been back to check on uh, this place in a while. So I wanted to see if there's any kind of uh, new stuff. You are one pathetic loser, dude. He got fired? <laughs> what a pathetic loser. Oh. Mm-hmm. Can we just drop down? Is that cool? Is that cool, bro? Ow. What's up, Matrix? You're a lifesaver. You know that? Another Looking health good, stim. Buddy. Look at that. <laughs> Always gotta have multiple poncho choices. I love I love the movie Stripes, dude. Hey, nobody call me Francis. <laughs> call me Francis. You're dead. Oh, I see. Wait just a goddamn minute. Oh, what the, what the heck? Something all the way over there. I think, I think we might need like some sort of super ultra mega jump um, to get into whatever that is there, maybe? Pretty sure. Die! Or maybe we can do this. No, this is this is this this wall is unrunnable. You cannot run on this wall. Oh, look at your dumb legs. If there's anything over here either. So we're just here to check out some new stuff. There's going to be some new things here. Yeah. I think we, have, we might have to get to, to get to that place, like from maybe from the other side or something. Oh! Do I run on the wall? That, that's, that's an unrunnable wall, is it not? It is an unrunnable wall. Oh! Okay, well, the bottom part is, is runnable. I just can't remember how to get out of here. <clears throat> can't climb up this way. Okay. I think we can just make this jump, though, can't we? Fuck you! Cannot. I'm just going to go up the other way, dude. Look all this. So when we did our flashbacks of our of our master teaching us all this like cool stuff, he never mentioned once about a wall that cannot be ran on. Because clearly there is walls that cannot be ran upon. So here we go. Some master, dude. Not the youngling. <clears throat> That's one way to do it. That's the only way to do it. Did you find something, BD one? Z gag wave. What? Oh, cool, man. Whoa. This is probably all new, huh? Looks pretty new. Swim boost. Hey. 
the, your parkour teacher. Every, 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 uh, every DeVry Jedi University student gets a complimentary, uh, parkour class, which is also online as well, so. It's, 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 the real thing's pretty tough. It's locked. What? Oh, nice. Nice. Doo -doo. Cordova's repair kit. He hoped someone would pick up his trail, but left BD1 to guide them. Welcome to DeVry Parkour 101. <laughs> You're standing on a rooftop. You see a, gar a garbage dumpster below and a refrigerator. Do you A, jump on the jump on the refrigerator and into the garbage dumpster, do a super badass f gainer off of it, <clears throat> Cordova's droid kit. He hoped someone would come along who could figure out the secret to the vaults. Oh, Hellbent, nice dude. That's probably a pretty good feeling. My friend... I flew with all haste to Coruscant and presented my findings to the council. I'll check it out. I'm gonna have to take a check, check, check it out. Droid Karn. These scraps served as Karns for the droids who helped build the research station on Bagano. Without their help, little would be known about the Zepho revolt. Got it. This hilt belonged to Cordova. Feels weird to say about someone I've never met, but... Sure, sure, sure. It's kind of comforting. Oh, I get it, I get it. I agree. This place is special. I I'm get taking it. this hilt with us. Emitter, switch, material. Duty and resolve. Duty. We've unlocked quite a bit of stuff already. We've only been playing this game for like almost six hours. It sounds like it sounds like my nerd voice. I should probably go over here and check it out. I don't know if you guys do this, but uh, at ats have like chin mounted lasers, and they're pretty strong. <laughs> so I'm surprised you didn't know that. Chin mounted laser blasters. Oh, here we go. Shortcut, dude. <clears throat> you gotta settle for a while. You can redo your subs. No worries, Hellbent. No worries. Hey, uh, Richard. Richard po Ponesner. Ponsner. Just clicking through randomly and found this channel. Good to meet you. Good to meet you too, Richard. Thanks for stopping on through, dude. I do appreciate you uh, coming on in. Just going through some uh, some some previously. Uh, previ previous planets just to see if, if we can find anything extra here. Which I'm pretty sure we should be able to. I think there's more. Th I know of one other chest that we haven't opened here that we can open now. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, my frames. My frame. You son of a bitch! <laughs> a Star Trek cannon? That sounds scary. Go get him. That was not a plunge. That was Death Stranding. It's it's awesome. Death Stranding is fucking incredible. One of the one of the finest games I've played all year. Uh, I still need to... I still need to finish it up. Hey! Fuck off! <clears throat> what the? Nope! I still need to finish it up. I'm on chapter 9, so we're, we're, we're pretty close. Uh, 
Be Greedfall? Uh, I still need to finish Greedfall, yeah. I'm, I'm at the very end of that as well. Well, I, I, I went... I had to get married. I had to get freaking married. Like, bleh, who does that? And I And we just kind of didn't finish it up. Someone may camp here. They were excited to discover a giant creature that lives close by. A binog, they called it. These fucking guys are the worst. Whew. Help me, BD. No, me. Way too close. Jesus. Okay. So, I'm pretty sure that the next... The last thing I can think of is right around here. It's right there. Yeah, that's it. Glorified FedEx person. Um, I mean, there's a lot of deliveries and stuff in it. Yeah, but it's one of the most unique gaming experiences I've I've ever I've ever had. It's it, I really really love movies, and it it just felt like uh, a truly cinematic experience. It was super immersive. It was amazing. Oh, all right then. Did you find something, BD One? Like I said, we got to finish it up. We're going to finish it up in the next couple of days, I'm sure. Truly immersive. All right, we got the thing that we needed. Uh, right. So we got to go back. This way? Berry. Berry. Oh, retro. Yeah, I've. I mean, I've. I've it really, really. I'm very much enjoying Death Stranding. I think it's incredible. Like I said, it's it's definitely contender for game of the year for me. All right, Bandit Workshop. Everything's been done down there. to get to that item over there. I don't think we do yet. The item is not... We're not able to get that thing yet. Let's go back this way. Let's let's hit up the old spaceship. Go to our next place. <clears throat> Tweet! Man, oh man. This place is the worst for my friends. Uh, the main character's face? My clown! This guy right here. Connor McDavid? How to get that goddamn double lightsaber? It was at, uh, uh, it was actually at Darth Maul's home planet. BD-1, keep an eye on Cal for us. Do, 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 do. Uh, I'm sure I can. I'm sure if there's a ball here, I'm sure I can push it. But we're going to go ahead and go to the next place. We can always come back here. Pick anywhere except Dathomir. Hate that place. Shut up. We're going to go to Kashyyyk because I really want to see it before the end of the stream. Play a couple more hours, but I want to get into Kashyyyk. <clears throat> uh, 
This whole journey has put a lot of wear and tear on the Manus. Like it was perfect before? It was a masterpiece, but now, ugh, just don't be surprised if I send you a bill. <laughs> Someone's low on funds. I mean, sure, okay, that may be part of it, but I'm used to it. Were you rich growing up? It's been six hours of a stream already. really a priority for Jedi. Yeah, well, I was poor too, but it wasn't so bad. My crew and I would find things to do for cheap. That's where I learned how to play Subhawk. A game which requires credits. Nobody cares. Strange choice. Well, we were kids. We bet all kinds of dumb things from food to funny shaped rocks. Unfortunately, things changed when we got older. Funny shaped rocks didn't go so far anymore. That's comedy. A galaxy would be a better place if they did. This guy is funny, dude. You are funny, man. Find the land. Get up here. It does feel like I just started. Time's just flown by. Star Destroyers! Oh, tell me we're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I break the Mantis' transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah? Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No sweat. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. Right. Don't All hit me. Right. Cut this dude in half. See, if I was a Sith Lord, I would just cut this bro in half. I don't see anything. You're preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. Doesn't look good. The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Monkeys have been enslaved or displaced. The mana tree. Oh, that was a close one, kid. Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Guerrilla fighters, Wookiees and off-worlders ambushing an Imperial convoy. Walker's approaching their position. Tarful could be with him. Tarful could be anywhere. Like, deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options. And, and we'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We used to scrap walkers on Bracca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in the Clone Wars. Captain, <laughs> get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen, those walkers double as troop Comedy. transport, so once you get inside, be careful. <laughs> no freeze grease to work as magic. Hey, do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. All right, if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. You ready for a swim, BD? <laughs> And you broke your back. I don't think I played Dawn of Mana, no. You ready to do this? The Rock Devil. What's up, man? Uh oh, we got some. <laughs> it's like we got some uh, Shadow of the Colossus happening here. How do we get on top? I don't know. Maybe it's these vines or something. Could be these gosh darn vines. Oh, 
Okay. Now where? Oh, I'm living in Australia. Yeah. That's how I. That's how I got this game so early. <laughs> so I live Let's in the future, this. dude. Are those the gin mounted laser blasters? Wow. Let's climb to the top. Thank you. Sweet. Chop it up, chop it up, dude. There's no pulse. Your turn to report fatalities. Surprise! Oh, that hurt. Just get him. EA! <laughs> Thank God I got it on PS4, dude. Oh, man. We would have crashed way more times on PC. Oh, this makes me feel this, this, this. Makes yeah, report a problem so it just goes straight through the tubes and right into the toilet. Great. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, dude. That that just that I'm. It makes me feel a lot better because with PC, I'm positive that we would have crashed like ten times by now. We would definitely. If it's crashing on PS4, dude, it's crashing on PC for sure. For sure. But that's a perfect opportunity. Six, six, it's been six hours. I'm going to take a quick break, guys. I'm going to be right back. Stick around. Don't go anywhere. Let me just um, <clears throat> take a quick break. And I'll be back. Just got to go to the bathroom. I got to make sure I have some water. <sighs> Jesus Christ. <clears throat> not saying that if you get this on PC, I'm not saying that you guys are going to have issues with, with crashing. For me, personally... Crashing is just a it's just an a, everyday kind of occurrence with with PC games, especially when we're dealing with like EA and stuff. So um, I'll be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. Hit that follow button if you haven't already. I start streams at 9 p.m. Pacific, six nights a week. Um, there's also some merchandise! Exclamation point merch. Get yourself a Mean Street shirt. I'll be right back. Dude, Daymare crashed so much that I couldn't I couldn't finish it, man. I couldn't actually finish that game because it was too crashy. It's 
No, not November. What are you going to do? It's no, not November. Grab a long sleeve. Nice, dude. Suspense, hell yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, Grey's Journey, the mustache just comes in on its own. I don't have to will it or anything. Just grows in until I shave it off. It's a real pain in the ass. Mm -hmm. It does look moldy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where are they gonna start me? Yeah, we're gonna be we're uh, I'm I'm getting with the the artists over at Bonfire, and we are gonna be creating new designs as well. Oh yeah. But we had to start the 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 merch store off with the with the mean streets though you just have to people ask about it all the time and dude suspense that long sleeve is so fucking comfortable you have to tell me how you like it dude their their long sleeves are so comfy they're amazing I wear mine I wear mine all the time. It's like my lounge and wear. I don't have a mean streets long sleeve yet, but I will. I just have one of the like the tester shirts they sent me. Your turn to report fatalities. <clears throat> this is it's the Jedi! It's the motherfucking Jedi! Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. I don't like our chances here. <laughs> At least they're honest. worked okay uh, throttle. report what's happening over there you're in violation of imperial protocol. shut that guy up we just three stooges those guys <laughs> let's do this so those are the blasters aim for the neck You said it. Let's move forward. The old head bobber here. Boink. Good lord, this part is loud as shit. Wow, that's a great, that's a fantastic <laughs> hand railing. Oh, those are my friends. Hey, who are you? Forrest Whitaker, what are you doing so here? I just brought an ad out to the table. Who are you? Someone making the Empire angry. We're advancing on an imp landing pad up ahead. Would my fire support? Copy that. Forrest, what are you doing, man? Angrier. Give me that Forrest Whitaker eye, dude. What happened? 
it's, I, I know that Forrest Whitaker I anywhere. Hootie! Four troopers there. Just keep coming. Yeah. Tiny robot, do something. How y'all such good friends of Forrest Whitaker? Oh, I'm, I've known him. I've known him since Bloodsport. Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? No, you're not doing that again. You just wrecked a perfectly good walker. Got a name? Cal Kestis. Saw Guerrero. What are you doing on Kashyyyk? Looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt and pill supply lines. Hey! So, Mr. Whiskey Richard, hell yeah. Looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Awful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. I haven't tried the tanks, Colin. The if they're anything like the shirts, See her? which I Grace. imagine they are, they're this is soft. awesome. How you doing? What do you want with Toph? Jedi business. Jedi are dead. Not all of them. <clears throat> you get that over corpse? My master gave it to me. <laughs> <laughs> this pad supports an imperial refinery that runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captives there are guerrilla fighters. I should help them. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but it is not built for close support. Comedy. We'll stay here and monitor imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. Join us when you're ready. Go! He's go. so fit. Forrest is so fit in this. Almost, almost a, a point. <clears throat> While descending into Kashyyyk's atmosphere, the Mantis crew became em embroiled in a skirmish between Imperial forces and Freedom Fighters, believing Wookiee chieftain Tarful could be among them cal jumped ship and hijacked an at at piloting it right into the infamous insurgent saw guerrero saw and his fighters were in the middle of a campaign to liberate a nearby warsher sap refinery rosher sap refinery with the possibility that tarful could be one of the wookies detained there cal and bd1 agreed to help bd wong It doesn't look like Forrest. It's got the he's got the he's got the Forrest Whitaker eye and everything. You're right. Heard Saw's hoping to find some news of Tarful at the refinery. 
A report came in this morning that he's been seen in the Shadowlands. In the Shields, really? I really love him in uh, in in Ghost Dog. If you like Forrest Whitaker and you haven't seen Ghost Dog, you got to see that man. Amazing, amazing. It's about a uh, <clears throat> a hired gun, a hitman that lives in New York City, and he he lives his life by way of the samurai. Glad you're all right. Yeah, yeah. Good to see you too. This place is a dump. Your plan worked, and now you want to follow. Got an OST by the RZA. What do you think of Saul's plan? He's fighting a losing battle. I doubt freedom for the Wookiees is his only goal. He seems trustworthy. He might prove to be. But there's more going on here than we know. And don't forget the Empire fights dirty. Watch your tail in that refinery, kid. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if either of you heard of the Parsons... Rumors and cantinas, but not much to go on. They call them radicals. Yeah, I heard the Empire's got bounties on their heads. It's probably not Chewy because we're on Kashyyyk, the, the Wookiee planets. Should I be worried about the bounties? Huh. I doubt it. War zones are bad for business. If the rumors are even true. Mm -hmm. Do you think the Inquisitors will find us here? It's possible. There you go, dudes. You better yeah. hope not. We barely made it here. Well, we couldn't leave the Parsons and Wookiees to die. Cal, your instincts are good, but that's not within your control. We can do our part. That's it. Nice, Colin. Very good, dudes. I hope you enjoy it, man. I was blown away by the quality of their their t-shirts, for sure. Be careful. The sweater, the sweatshirt didn't fit me super well. <clears throat> Um, but then again, I have like a cartoon character's body, but I haven't tried the hoodies. It's just the sweatshirt that they sent me. Their shirts are amazing though. Woo. Hey buddies. Invisible walls. Good, 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 good. Anything goes wrong with this plan, we're finished. Mari's mapped out the nearest garrisons. The Empire won't have time to send reinforcements. We'll be okay. That's your plan? If we can do it quick. Saw's seen us through worse. I've got nothing but respect for that man, but this isn't a forest skirmish. I hope we're ready. I'm just listening. Go on. Wait, these guys got something to say? Things are even worse here than on Zepho. Did you say Zepho? I used to live there before the Empire came. Do you know it? Yeah, I've been. It's horrible what happened. We weren't able to fight back. But here, with the Wookiees, we have a chance. Oh, Ben. Thank you for standing with us. Oh, Ben! Caricatures. A brave fighter, Mariana. <clears throat> Mariana serves saw Garar's forces on the besieged world of Kashyyyk. After losing her husband on Zepho, her journey takes her across the galaxy in her battle against the Empire. I'll check it out. Uh, oh, yeah, the trash can droids. Gonk droid. EG-6 power droids, also known as gonk droids, serve as portable power generators in mobile operations or in situations lacking a stable power source. They are utilized by civilians and military alike, often emitting a low honking noise that sounds like the word gonk. That's cool. That's, that, that's, that's kind of a fun little tidbit. It's a fun little nugget. <laughs> Moving out. Moving out. Saw should be at the other end of this trench. Go, go, no, don't, 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 don't. Let's check out the bench over there. Give me something useful. Check that freaking bench out, dude. What do you say? <laughs> oh, 
How much current can you conduct? Oh, it's, it's, it's a trash can with shoes on. Circuit Imperial Tech. I know <laughs> the suspense. That I was. That's what I was talking about before. Oh, I thought that this was just like things that are just supposed to get in your way. They're for something. They're always for something. Oh, Jesus! Oi. It's Tim. Now. Wow. Scan this bitch. Okay. So now I can do things. Now I can do other things. I really can't scan this, dude. I really want to scan this guy. There we go. Scan it. Hey. It almost, it almost let me scan it. I was close. <clears throat> uh, no, I could, I could switch it up. I've got different moves and stuff. Let's try it. the charge okay <clears throat> single lights a uh, single saber slower it doesn't it doesn't attack like th uh, things that are like around okay I see <clears throat> like the the double lightsaber does more area damage uh, I feel like it's just I don't know. I, I, I switched to I switched to single on single targets. I didn't do it with the with the with this guy. I usually do though, because I like this move here, which is pretty boss. Interesting. I wonder how we get over to that thing. We're gonna be finishing Death Stranding really soon. I got this game <coughs> very, very early, so we I decided to play this all day instead. No, you didn't miss it. No, we're gonna we're gonna finish it up tomorrow. We're doing uh, a couple of hours of Death Stranding in the in in at the beginning of the stream, and then we're gonna be doing a two hour sponsored broadcast with uh, a new MMO that's coming out, and then we're gonna be switching it back to Death Stranding and, and hopefully uh, finishing that thing up. Kingdom Under Fire. It is Kingdom Under Fire. But hey, man, I gotta pay the bills. Hopefully, hopefully I enjoy it. I need to charge this. I 
<laughs> You're not hating. Okay, good, good. No, that's going to be happening tomorrow. We've already streamed for six and a half hours. That's going to be tomorrow. Airborne pests with flammable posterior will spontaneously combust in close proximity or upon death. The pesky flame beetle is a flying insectoid known for its bioluminescent combustible posterior ass. These creatures synthesize chemicals derived from local flora into a highly flammable derivative. Extreme caution should be exercised when in close proximity. Hmm. Ugh. Jedi, over here. You're working late, so you're in. Ugh. Sarah's gonna get off work here probably in the next couple of hours. I'm gonna make her some some dinner. So I was thinking about putting it in an eight-hour stream today. And then I believe she has tomorrow off, and then she does like six days where I'm not gonna see her at all. Uh, not yet, Dingy, not yet. Maybe later. Imperial Sap Refinery lies dead ahead. What does the Empire want with tree sap? Nothing good. They refine the sap into a powerful compound, and they're rushing to expand production. We have to stop them. That's the plan. We don't know they're in danger, but they spread themselves too thin. Has. Oh, well, thank you so very much, Has. I appreciate that very much, dude. Welcome back for five months. Here you go, bud. Thank you very much. These refineries double as brutal prison camps. We use those cutters to create a distraction while you take your lightsaber and free the Wookiees inside. We need their help to stop the Empire. Understood. Watch yourself in there. See ya. You hear that? Said he needs my help. Come on, buddy. Hey, yes. <clears throat> A new objective. We gotta free these Wookies. Tree. Oh, we have two points, did? Mm hmm. What's this? Waiting longer. Right, 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 right. Additional life when using stim canisters. Very important. Stim potency is increased. Mm hmm. The maximum force. Thank you. Over there, one of the cutters turned on. Are they running some kind of drill? Maybe. Some kind of freaking drill over there? Or... You see there he is, blast him. I do two. You only get two deflections. Wookie warriors left this. They use this place as a hideout in their battle against the Empire. I see. Kind of a dump. <laughs> the floating. 
Too many baskets. What's going on? How are you? Well, that was helpful. Hey. Hey, what the? He's always so surprised when that happens. Hey, what the heck, one? BD? BD Wong, you son of a gun. R2! Sorry. <laughs> he was gonna tell the others. We found the Jedi. What are you? It's a very good move. He knew too much. <laughs> Do we scare you? You're dead now, so. Yes. Don't let him get you. He's gonna get me! Break's over. Yeah, got it. Wow. BD1. How can we win? What? <clears throat> oh, they're scanning him up. Scoring. Scout Trooper Commanders lead squads of specially trained stormtroopers into combat for the Galactic Empire. Scout Commanders armed with riot batons are extremely adept in melee combat and should not be taken lightly. We're dead. Huh? Whoopsie. Yeah, so there was a platform down there. I probably should have just done this. Yeah, I guess so. I guess we will. What the hell is this doing over here? What is this? Oh, it's just like an extra little place to, to save your game. So you can't grab onto the sides of this. That's one thing that really, I really do not enjoy, is not being able to grab onto certain things. Especially if there's clearly an edge to it, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm just splitting hairs. I'm splitting hairs now. I don't know. We gotta, we gotta start. Whoa. Fight us, you coward! I that. You piece of shit! Let him get away! Going in for the kill. This guy's going in for the kill. Let's give him a thrashing. Hey, give him a thrashing. That's smarts, doesn't it? Split ends are pretty annoying. I know I had long hair for many years. What you train for? You. Remember your training. Looks like you're blocked. I'll fix that. Never seen a trooper like that. Wow. Electrostat purge trooper. Capable of counterattacks after being parried. Remain vigilant. Hunters of the Imperial Inquisitor Inquisitorius, the purge troopers, track survivors of the treasonous Jedi Order. Operating in the shadows, they score the galaxy to assist inquisitors in their sinister mission this specialized class is skilled primarily with the electro staff providing a lethal challenge to any lightsaber wielding foe their agility and penchant for vengeance are displayed through a deadly combination of intuitive counterattacks and trained maneuvering they remember their briefing Keep moving, Jedi. They, open. they remembered the briefing
Tight fit, huh, BD? Yeah, what do you think? What do you think, BD Wong? My frames. Flame beetles, they're coming through the walls. Fight them with flames! <laughs> it's quickly, fight them with flames! It's not working, they're just getting hotter! Hey, BD1. He can't beat all of us. I can't do this by myself. I can't I see. You know. Hell, BD Wong. He's great, isn't he? You sure you want to plug into this thing? He already did. Okay. Whoa. Very, oh, good, 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 good. Not exactly sure what that did. Oh, oh just moved it out of the way. That's why you wanted to move this thing. Hey, I figured it out too. You had no idea that was there, did you? You just wanted to turn that cutter on. Oh, BD Wong. That's comedy, dude. Nice, we've got we've got a skill here. <clears throat> Holding push allows Cal to push groups of enemies and stagger large enemies. <clears throat> That's pretty badass though, I do like that. When using dash strike, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's classic Wong right there. No! Yeah, that's pretty good. I did not rest. I probably should do that. I keep forgetting that. Even if you spend your points, you're not resting. You're not meditating. You have to pray to your false gods. Pray to your false gods, Cal! I think I saw something. I think I saw something. Oh, mama. Take the shot. Quite a squidge. Quite a squidge there. Patrol the base. Got another breach down here. Some kind of webbing. Hey, who's that? Sounds like a spider. Oh, God. Copy that. <clears throat> Imperial stormtroopers were dispatched to fend off incoming attacks from local wildlife. They encountered fiercer resistance than they were prepared for. Mother effer. Oh. Mother of God. Stim, now. No! Help me, Bush! Not the Bush's baked beans. Scan him. What I wanted to scan, I wanted to. Oh, wait, yeah, I did. I did want to scan that. Lurking in the subterranean darkness, the vile albino Wishock 
is a rare but insidious horror to encounter, feeding off the brains of its prey for centuries. This nasty venom-spewing atrocity is far more aggressive than its common cousin. Highly intelligent and capable of super speed, this Wishox lunge attack is more vicious and dangerous. Known for its its insatiable appetite for human flesh, its viciousness, and of course, knowing the secret recipe to Bush's baked beans. But he'll never tell. <clears throat> Dumped like a truck. Truck, truck. Hmm. Not today, Buster. I guess that's that looks like the just the, the like a secret thing up there, huh? What the? What the who? What? Reporting a live cutter near the cell block. There he is. Blast him. It's breaking through and destroying everything. Get up here. He's moving. Jedi's in the move. Blast! Don't let him get you. Damn it. All allied units down. There we go. Toss me a stem, BD one. Close one. Wait, did we miss the thing that was on on the tippy tops? There was something on the tippy tops. There they are. Blast them. I guess. I guess we didn't get it. <laughs> I was pretty, I was on there. Still alive in there? So far, almost to the prison. Good. Imperial distress calls are going out across the planet. If you don't get the prisoner soon. Capture, I haven't seen The Mandalorian because I think we have to have uh, Disney Plus or whatever. And I think Disney Plus isn't in Australia for like another week or something like that. They're shipping it by freighter. It's not gonna be here for like a week. That's if the if it doesn't get waylaid by pirates or something. And sunk in an old timey sea battle. This, I promise. Shanghai. Rams. Whoopa. A Jedi will be here any minute. And our reinforcements. <laughs> Good. Spice the spider captain. I'm taking point. Yeah. You wanna handle this? Yeah. Get up here. Hurry! He's not invincible. Get him! I am invincible. That was our last uh, range uh, trooper. Move up. Okay, okay. Okay, that hurts. Get out of there! You have to jump Stim, to go off here. of ledges. For some reason. Up, I'm gonna get you, sucker! Oh, son of a bitch. You cannot escape. 
Not today. Not today, Buster. Ah. Will you fucking uh, I need do one. the thing? There we go, buddy. What the? Great. Oh, I did drop his arm off. Oh, did I? No, I didn't. Damn it. I was hoping I chopped his arm off. Sorry. This needs power. Oh wow, okay. That's, oh oh wow. Yeah, power. This thing needs power or something. It's freaking power or something. I don't know. Oh I see. Oh wow. Oh man! Oh I think oh we need like a we need like a force pull, maybe. Wait, since we're going to be a good guy the whole time, does that mean we don't get a force choke? It's my favorite thing to do in KOTOR, was to force choke these guys until they poop their pants. That's a shame. I squeeze out them doo-doos like, like an old tube of toothpaste. Die, slug monster! Hey! PD1, it's them! No lightning, dudes. That shit was the bomb. That was, that was the bomb.com. Really, no game did it, did it, did it better than KOTOR. Because you get to be a Sith Lord, dude. You get those that, that, the finger lightning and, and, the, and the force choke. Hey now. Something we can use? I would just go through towns and just just demolish the the entire town. Just entire groups of people. Howdy, how are you? <laughs> just fry them up. Force choke them. Ultimate power. What a roughage. Ew, ew, ew. Okay. Oh, really? Uh, okay. Guess that's that's better than nothing, I suppose. Okay, this is where we're before. The vines grew back, I guess. <clears throat> Min Mingarm, we are about seven hours into the game. Force massage. <gasps> Actually, wow, that's that feels pretty good. Thanks, bro. Pretty good so far, though. Oh my god, <laughs> dude! I was I was stupid powerful. I thought we were playing it on hard modes. Maybe I'm mistaken. I thought we were playing a hard mode. It's, we just completely annihilated everything. We were uh, like basically like a Sith wizard, and just went straight up all force powers and just fucking demolished everything. I was like a walking uh, WMD. Great. I have not tried... What the heck? I have not tried it on mobile, no.
What's it play like? Um, it plays a lot like like an Uncharted or well, like a Tomb Raider, but in the Star Wars universe where you have like some pretty great combat, some good combats. Uh, the I will say that the the immersiveness playing as a Jedi, the immersiveness is 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 there for sure. I don't think there's really much many choices, Mingarm. No, it's pretty linear. Oh god, I thought I was gonna crash again. Please, Lord. Hot sauce? Crawling with Colonel Butt Blaster's ass blasting hot sauce. Um, which of the last three Tomb Raiders? I really don't know the difference. I played all of them. I don't really know. They were all pretty much the same to me. Uh, but I, I don't know. Just an Uncharted. It's like exploring around spooky places. In the Star Wars universe, as the Empire expands its control over Kashyyyk. It sets its sights on the Shadowlands. If we if we did the Pepsi challenge right now, I liked I do I did like the Tomb Raiders. They just didn't really leave a lasting impression on me. If we did the Pepsi challenge with all the the most recent Tomb Raiders, I would not be able to pick them out which one is which. But, I mean, it's, we're not, I'm not talking about, like, story-wise. I'm talking about, like, gameplay-wise, you know? Did I, did I get this thing up and running or what? I guess I didn't. Oh, maybe it's this. It's got good gameplay, yeah. No guards. Yeah, they were average. Hey, we're here to free you. You're not alone. I do like the third person view. Yeah. This is set uh, between the third and fourth movie. Or not third and fourth, but episode three and four, you know. Visitation is not permitted. You are having an accident. You are having an accident. I know, KOTOR 3 would be amazing. Heavily built and easy to read, they are highly susceptible to parrying. Outdated system vulnerable to hacking by updated dro dro droid units. That looks like an L. Droid! Imperial security droids, also known as KX series security droids, are commonly used in service to the Galactic Empire. Formidable and specialized in close combat, these droids employ a combination of brute strength and rugged durability to capture and incapacitate enemies. They are equipped with a full comm relay, scramblers, an omelet maker, and tactical programming. They start fucking. Oh. <laughs> ah. Glad to help. Crash test. What's up? Who's ready to fight some amps? 
This guy. All right, let's help these Wookiees get back in the fight. Great work, Jedi. I know. I'm super good at this. <clears throat> Hi. My frames. My frames are locked up tight. Josek. Okay. I'm also super duper humble. <laughs> so that's what makes me such a great Jedi. And my dick is massive, dude. Saw's up ahead. We must be close. Oh, Jesus. <gasps> oh! We're pushing them back. Keep it up. Go for shot. They're pretty quick. Well, I'm a Jedi, so. Gotcha. Throw money at him. Come here, BD1. Whoosh. Is it why Kylo Ren went to the dark side? I think it's because he was so emotional. Uh oh. Uh oh. You can do it, EA. You got this, buddy. Oh, we're there. <clears throat> Super effective. Hold. Hold. Does that sound like we could freaking use her? Or what? What? What do you? What do you? Just won't open. I just. I. I can't. I just. There's. I. I can't do it. That's. Some, that's something I just can't do. Hey, yeah. Those last few pixels were a doozy. <laughs> You did it, bro! What the hell's that? Mm hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and just dunk myself into this pit really quick. Okay, looks like we might need to have some sort of super duper jump. Sort of mega jump. Okay, we gotta get up there. Or is that where we came down at? No, it is not. Pew, 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 pew. Oh. Oh. There's something down there. Force jump, yeah. If we had a force jump, I'd be jumping the I'd be jumping the fuck out of here, dude. I'd be getting out of these dreams and into my car. <clears throat> this Wookiee died from toxic fumes. The Empire is poisoning the planet. From to from toxic shock. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I went back and grabbed that. Fall back to the prisons. Forest. Where are you, buddy? What the hell is this for, anyway? I don't think this is for anything in particular. Pump. 
Maybe we were supposed to go down there. Well, we definitely need to switch this up, I guess. There you go. Eighty one. Making sure you're still there. Okay. <clears throat> Living in the bay, what's up, dude? You can't you can't spin around? I guess we can't spin around. It's just not the Jedi way. But if you, I think, I think, <laughs> I don't, th I don't, I don't think that Cal knows. If you're in the middle of something that's spinning, you can just basically just move your feet just a tiny bit. You don't really have to worry too much. But he's new. He's new at this. Got a scan? Looking. Hasn't had that flashback yet. Now remember, young Padawan, if you find yourself on a platform that's just about to spin, don't worry, because if you stand in the middle, you can just move your feet slightly. I just don't get it! You'll learn. This refinery was designed only with yield in mind. No thought given to the comfort of safety of the incinerated. Wookiee workers are chained together with no privacy, often covered in mud or dangerous industrial byproduct. And hair. So much hair. Spin effect. What's up, man? To the prisons. We need the Wookiees to finish this. Hurry! We've got reinforcements! Go, go, go. Yo. We've gotta get them out of there. Up. Here. Just don't be next. Yeah. <laughs> Just don't be next. Do it. What the heck? Another one of these pieces of shit. Trivial opposition. I thought that was a shortcut. That was pretty boss. That was cool. You've done it! The Wookiees are free! Get to the roof! <laughs> Low poise damage. Gotta get that Hornet's ring, dude. Free the Wookiees. Done and done. Another objective to leave you the hollow map. Meet Saw on the rooftop. Oh, man. When is this release? Uh, it's like a couple couple of hours ago. Just, it released, um, yeah, a couple, a couple hours ago or something. Something like that. We're about seven hours into it. It, it, it released this morning uh, in uh, Australia's, because because I live in the future. But bum 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 bum. Lag Rider, thank you so very much, dude. For gifting up those subs, my man. Ah. To Jesta, forced to reckon with Caleb, the true crazy. Hugo, thank you so much, man. It's very kind of you, dude. 
Wookiees probably smell terrible. Probably not nearly as bad as, as, as my dog, Chappy. He's pretty fucking stinky. <clears throat> and Gray gains some force when he when he hits a blocking enemy. That's pretty good too. Yeah, Cab Drew, it's not too shabby. That's 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 the uh I mean I've already paid my penance having such shitty internet here. <clears throat> I've paid my penance. Gifted hard, baby. Gifted so hard. The man-eating centipede, dude. That shit is spooky. What'd that do? What'd that do? Oh, it did something over there. Aha, of course. <coughs> Gonna go meet this dude on the, on the rooftop. Oh, come on. Back up, I've got this. <laughs> Back up, I've got this, he says. What's your plan there, bud? What was the plan? Resisting. Stop resisting. Criminy. Get ready, buddy. Get out. We don't have the firepower to breach this hole. We're on it. Target is mobile. Whoa. Ding, 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 ding. Uh oh. Uh oh. Spaghetti -o. Oh. Get the fuck out of there. Oh, that one hit point dream, dude. It's the one hit point dream, son. Get out of it! Where are you going? the music oh god I was gonna say boy I hope that was supposed to happen everyone forest these have been hard years We've lost comrades, friends, family, to the Empire. Dark times. 
And yet the fire still burns. Hope still burns. The Jedi are not yet lost. We are not yet lost. Kashyyyk is not yet lost. Do we applaud now? Oh, yeah. There it is. I lost my contact. Everybody, hold on. You've seen what the Empire has done to Kashyyyk. These stories are playing out all over the galaxy. My partisans could use a Jedi on our side. I'm honored. But we have our own mission I can't walk away from. I'm a Weasley Not after yet. all. The offer stands. Keep it in mind. Cal, mm -hmm. I'm Mari Kosan. What's up? And this is Commander Choisik. Uh, sorry. I'm not quite fluent. Choisik says he'll do whatever he can to find Tarful and vouch for you. Do you think he's still alive? Have faith, Cal. We'll be in touch with your ship. For the cause. <laughs> Belly rubs. You smell You know awful, Tarful? Dude. Wait! Freedom fighter Mary Kosan serves Saw Gerrera's forces on Kashyyyk in their desperate battle against the Empire. Her bravery and dedication to the cause make her a valuable ally to the Wookiees. She provides Cal with vital information about Wookiee chieftain Tarful, which helps his mission. He was part of Tarful's crew, but got captured on a mission. Tarful couldn't risk more warriors to save him. He spent months in that refinery. Choisik will help you find Tarful. They're always on the move. Could take some time. And that's all I can ask. Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're uh, over seven hours into the game, so I'm not sure how far that is. We're on the fourth planet. Seems like Saw's willing to do whatever it takes. He has his own way of doing things, yes. But these are dire times. We need leadership like Saw's. Even when it means risking your lives? Someone has to stand up to the Empire. Why not us? I admire that. And we have something in common. Safe journey, Cal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sure. Sure. This is just a drug deal. They'll be okay. Gotta jolt this thing. So, what's your count at? I think 20. I'm at 14. Give me catch up. That's what you sound like, dude. Oh, I will. The longer I stay alive, the more imps I get to take out. Justice for what they did to your home. Our mm -hmm. home. <laughs> We're all in this together. You don't even have a name. Cause. We're family. Your name is Partisan. Happened to yours, happened to mine. You are one pathetic loser. You are one pathetic loser, dude. Look at you. Oh, what's going on here? What is that? <laughs> Like a little pubic hair tuft down there. I'm glad we could help the Wookiees. Free and the oppressed, that's where the passion to keep fighting comes from. Every death, every dead end creates a fighter who isn't afraid to lose. Enough of them, and we'll take the day. You got it. We did it. By the skin hey, remember of our me? Teeth. It'll be harder without your help. Remember? I know. But I can't abandon my mission. I understand. I got intel that may help you. That is Forrest Whitaker. A few Whitaker. rotations ago, my people searched an abandoned Wookiee village nearby. That is Forrest Whitaker. No right? Tawful, but we did find out the safest route to the Shadowlands is through this refinery. I built an escape plan if this didn't work out. 
You get to him fast. When you're ready to find Tafu, that's the way to go. You've been fighting for so long. Remember me? Have you learned anything from war? Remember? Nothing unites people like tragedy. Everything the Empire takes from us only makes us stronger. Each injustice spurs others to join our cause. If we stand together, we can win. Just like today. Thank you. It is Forrest Whitaker. Wasn't he wasn't he in like Rogue One or something? Wasn't he in the Star Wars? We'll keep fighting. We'll keep fighting. Yeah, he's in Rogue One. We'll send word when we find Tarful. You got it. So we gave it some juice. What what did we give juice to? We gave this we gave that thing some juice. We should probably not have the juice going because it's it's um there's a fire. There's a fire there. So Imperial communications, and I picked up something. Project Augur has been reactivated. The Empire may be close to finding another Zeppo tomb. Looks like we still have work to do. Me too. Dude, what the heck? Oh, right. New allies. After freeing the imprisoned Wookiees and taking the refinery from the Empire, Cal still had no information on Tar Tarful's whereabouts. Luckily, Choisic. Ch one of the Wookiees Cal helped liberate had fought alongside Tarful in the past. He and Marie Kosan, a member of Saw's guerrilla fighters, agreed to find Tarful for Cal. However, just as he received this news, Seer discovered an Imperial transmission, revealing the imp Empire was close to unearthing another tomb on Zepho. It is a lot like Tomb Raider. There's, there's, there's a lot of talk about tombs. Polly Shore's in it too. The wheel. Uh. You think Saw and the others will be okay? Always looking on the bright side, huh? Hey, uh, thanks. Thanks, man. These specialized Imperial flamethrowers have been modified to more effectively incinerate Kashyyyk's wildlife. For everything. I could assume a, fi a flamethrower would be pretty effective against, uh, Wookiees as well. And it would smell awful. Oh, man. Hey, Seer. Cal, good to see you back in one piece. Mari Kosan contacted us. We know you couldn't find Tarful. I love risking our lives for nothing. It's fantastic. It wasn't for nothing. Mari and Choisik will come through. I like your optimism. We could all use a little of that now and then. Hey, I'm a positive guy, too. I'm positive that if I die, I'll be very upset. You did good, Cal. We might not have found Tarful yet, but you saved lives today. Is it, is it... Don't forget that. Thanks. Wait, making copies, that's a Rob Schneider quote. Is it Polly Shore or is it Rob Schneider? Later, Cal. Please. Either one is, is pretty rough. Just let me know when you want to go. Okay. He's in the juice. <laughs> they blend together. Polly Shore. Rob Schneider is a carrot. There's no one you want to go. Uh huh. Did we get anything cool? <sighs> okay. <clears throat> He's about to find out that being a carrot isn't all it's cracked up to be. Oh, we didn't get any more seeds. That thing is really growing. Ooh. Picking our next destination? Yeah. Follow your instincts. Oh, is that, is that what I gotta do? Let me follow your instincts. 
That's all I ask me. You, know, you, you got to do what you do. Do whatever you want to, you know, do. I guess we got to go to the zip file. It's a main objective. What are you doing? Back to Zepho. Now I gotta listen to this guy try out his comedy routine. The Empire might have found a Zepho tune. Every Star Wars space monster is a comedian. Pity. Heard about a high stakes game from one of Sauce fighters. A few extra credits couldn't hurt, you know? Gambling? Grease, use your head. And cue the one joke. Of these days, <laughs> the Haxian brood is going to catch He's gonna up. gonna have a joke. <laughs> Those slubs? I'll hear them coming from a parsec away. I don't need your gambling habit causing us more trouble with murderous criminal syndicates. You're right. You're right. I know it. I just want to blow off some stress every once in a while, you know? Anyway, all of that is in the past. I'm sure it won't be a problem. Can I sit down now? All right, we're here. Thank you. Get in your chair. Get in your goddamn chair! Anybody want to talk to me? Where is everybody? Oh, they're probably outside, huh? Well, that was quick. Then you, th you want to check out the new sla the saber sleeve? I guess we could check that out. It's like the the most minute changes. I want to get one that like the like the bad guy has in this with like the the thing around. It's like a keyblade hand guard. We're supposed to be guards. Premium, dude. Premium. <laughs> Textures. Sure. Wow. A purple one. Seems like a pink one. Corundum. The compensator. Nice. Show me that button change. <laughs> wow. Oh, did we did we get some more of this junk? All pretty much the same. Pretty standard stuff. I like that premium, dude. It's, it's a whole new game now. That pink lightsaber, dude. <laughs> ah. Explore the, the thing. Oh my god. All the way out there? I guess we gotta go down through there, huh? There's a long journey ahead of us. These ancient tombs didn't survive all <laughs> this Zeno. time because they were easy to find. It's a challenge I'm willing to take. I can see that. I'm glad you believe in what we're trying to accomplish. I believe in this quest. I always have. Ever since I was a youngling, I trusted in the Force. You were a youngling? Those names on the list, they're a test. And I believe I will succeed. I like your confidence. A journey like this one can challenge you in ways you've never been before. I understand. I think I'm ready. We've got your back, Cal. You were in Mad TV. The homeworld of the Zepho. Cordova must have spent a lot of time here. Cordova spent his life studying the history of the galaxy in many different places. Dragged me along on a few expeditions. It was educational. He really believed in the past? He believed in the future. But you can't have a future without the past. Cal's hair will remember this. Picking up anything? Nothing new. It still feels risky. I don't think we have a choice. We always have a choice. The people the Empire has left behind, destroyed and controlled, are depending on us. On you, Cal. I know. 
I'm glad I have you two to back me up. And we will. YouTube? We all have to support each other. That's the only way to succeed. All right, all right, all right, all right. We still have a lot of work to do, Cal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm glad that you're getting work after that whole Mad TV thing, you know. I mean, I, I enjoyed some of Mad TV. It wasn't great. What was that? What the heck? Effective. Your odds of surviving are low. Very low. Damn it. I'm Just not doing all the work. There you go. You can't escape. Jeez. You will regret that. Mm hmm still resisting yeah. unwise <clears throat> uh that lady is from mad tv yeah <laughs> she is dude will sasso was was the star of the show dude will sasso was incredible that dude is funny as hell. Don't get in my way. Don't get in my freaking way. Whoopsie. Wait, 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 wait. What is that? It's blocked. Okay, it's a blocked dough. We have to get over here and do the thing there, I guess. Are you gonna attack me now? Phil Lamar? Yeah, and now and now Phil is like an, just an incredibly seasoned, battle-hardened uh, voice actor. He's incredible. Fuck off. Move up already. Get him already. Wait, just hit this freaking guy. Oh, I need backup to kill you. Stop slipping away. <clears throat> Mr. Show came back on Netflix. Yeah, it's called Bob and David, but it, uh, unfortunately it only has one season. And I've seen that season ten times. Still good though. Still good. Even even when I rewatch it now. Of course it didn't get an audience. It's just it's too fucking good. It's too good. When shows are too good, they don't get renewed for new seasons. But if you have a show like Big Bang Theory, idiots just gobble it up like it's slop. Like it's pig slop. <laughs> Oh, wait, I think we have to go through the other side. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Mr. Show didn't either. It's because it's because if, they, if you don't have a laugh track nowadays, people people don't they don't know when to laugh. They just don't know. Oh yeah, we do have to go back this way. They have no idea. They're just not smart enough to know when they should laugh. Which is too bad. Who's there? I see you. I see you, piece of shit. There's truth in that statement. It is, man. There is truth. Well, just wait for wait for your cue to laugh. Burgers. Good morning.
Okay, this is the way. I feel like I'm going the wrong way, but hopefully this is the right way to go. No. Fight us, you coward! What no! you moving? You you killed them all! I did, I did. You piece of shit. down this way I think it should be I think that's that's pretty pretty standard stuff looks like it's through some sort of icy place maybe <clears throat> I hope those men had families and I hope they miss them very much I hope they were loved I hope they were fantastic fathers Make sure we're not passing it, dude. I don't want to go down any kind of, like, slide like, past this shit. Ugh. That's not... Okay. <clears throat> Unnecessary. I've sh I missed the target, you don't say. Ow! Get out of my face. Oh my god, what's happened to the, the map? Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. See ya. Don't fall behind. The Jedi. <laughs> the, the Jedi. Get him. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. That was nice. Oops. Can I be called? Sure. Think you can handle this, Speedy? make that look easy. Oh, he's a robot. Do not concern yourself with a missing artifact. I'll deal with it personally. Getting those deflections down, yeah. I think I think the deflections just get tougher and tougher as as you I think you can do more, more than two. It's just harder as it goes on. Missing artifact, a crate used by the Empire to transport relics found in the excavation. An Imperial officer seems to have Misleadings about it. Okay. <clears throat> Christopher Walken in Suicide Kings, incredible. One of my one of my one of my favorite endings. One of my the types of endings that I just love so much that I love to see in movies. That should happen a lot more. I actually use that as an example all the time when we start talking about movies, the Suicide Kings. <laughs> about being a baby that wasn't born yet. What's the ending? Well, basically the <clears throat> all the all like all the main characters I mean if 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 you if you don't want if you want to watch Suicide Kings right now, close your close your ears. Basically in Suicide Kings, these like college students or whatever, these rich college kids uh kidnap Christopher Walken who's a mob boss and the whole time he's telling them like you're not going to survive this. You should probably just let me go so you might save yourselves. At the end of the movie, they all they all fucking die. <clears throat> Christopher Walken wins because um, these these college kids were idiots, 
and it's like you want you like the whole movie like you want to feel for the for these for these kids and, and you know they're doing it for the right reasons and stuff but no they died they die They knew he was a mob boss, yeah. So they, they just you, uh, sealed their fate. You know any jokes, BD? I don't know. Why? It's spoiler free. <laughs> yeah, you're good, Mr. Zack. Tell us how Look Who's Talking ends. Well, basically, all you need to know is <clears throat> Mr. Toilet Man eats your pee pees and your doo doos. Here we go. There's gotta be some information on their excavation inside, right? No. Always looking on the bright side. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. It's a robot. Oh my lord. What are you? Wow. How can I understand you? That's not what I wanted. Whoa. Oh, get him. He's just disappointed. I'm not an easy target, I'm just standing still. You piece of shit. Hey! Oh, that guy, they just he just blew his buddies up, that's awesome. Stim BD? Feeling better. It is Ginger Jedi. You can change your clothes, you can change your lightsaber and stuff, but you're forever doomed to look like a, a good guy doll. Let's be best friends. <laughs> better get in there, buddy. That <laughs> looks like a goddamn Kyle. <laughs> Jedi, form up. Get the target. I can beat him. Let's move, BD. Let's see what's behind here. Mm hmm. Looks like a spooky guy. Looks like a pretty scary guy in there. I have not played all the way through The Force Unleashed. I think I have it. <clears throat> I think I played it for a little bit. Never on stream. This is like before I started streaming. Whoa. Are you fucking... Stim beady. Stimmy, bitch. This guy's fast with the butt of his gun, dude. He's very good. <laughs> Are the Inquisitors coming? It's possible, but we're far from Bracca. They might think purge troopers are enough. Or they could be stalling you on. <clears throat> Danger from a distance. Make attempts to close distance quickly. Avoid shot grenades. Or use it to strike nearby stormtroopers. Agents of the Inquisitorious Purge Troopers are charged by the Empire to hunt down survivors of the treasonous Jedi Order. Operating in the shadows, their clandestine mandate is largely unknown, even among Imperial ranks, as they support Inquisitors across the galaxy. 
This specialized class is trained and equipped with a variety of weapons and tactics, but primarily attack with blasters and shot grenades. Purpose. What, a cool, what a cool guy. Hey, that's a cool guy. Soup is tasty, what's up? Any sign of the tomb? No. And the Empire's yeah, I heard it's pretty good. Security. Keep your focus. Watch out for him, BD. Okay. We'll keep looking. Okay. It's the point of no return there, buddy. Whoa. Pray to your false gods. <clears throat> Only push allows cow to push groups of enemies and stagger large. I would like to, to, to push more. I would like that. An airborne attack that allows cow to push away nearby enemies when he lands. Cal automatically deflects blaster bolts while he's sprinting or while running. Uh, yeah, dude. Uh, yes. That's pretty good. Smite World Championship for 2019 starts well soup. Damn, dude. Damn. I've never played Smite. I'm gonna get dunked if I jump in there, dude. About to get mega dunked. Mega dunk! Oh, okay. It's one of those games where if you, if you, uh... Hey, Grease, you if busy? You, if you didn't start... Well, I was trying to watch the... You know, right when it came no, out, busy, it's too late. Never You'll never be able so, to play it ever. Uh, You'll get fucking crushed. I'm standing next to two crashed ships. Looks like you weren't the only pilot who had trouble with the wind here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just realizing that? Where have you been? I mean, it doesn't get better than me. Yeah, okay. All I wanted to say was thanks. Uh, you know, you're, uh... You're, you're welcome, kid. But, uh, I... You know, I gotta go. I, I gotta think. So, gotta... See I've never played League or Dota, either. Another couple of games that if you didn't start at the very beginning, there's no reason to play it now. <laughs> there's no reason to, man. You get fucking demolished. Need you to charge this, BD. Charge, 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 charge it up, BD. I screwed up. Whoa! Wow! Holy shit. Okay, there's no running on those walls. Oh, I see what's going on. Zephonian skull. Building some kind of work line. Some sort of freaking skull. Ah! 
that slow ass piece of trash. Okay. Great! This thing's gonna oh, kill please. me now. Help me! <clears throat> Got you. Ooh. Scanned. Good scan, BD. Good scan, buddy. Great scan. No, not a good scan, a great scan. <clears throat> Jotaz, strong but slow, strike after dodging any attack. The Jotaz is a formidable and highly aggressive predator that utilizes brute strength to establish supremacy. A thick hide provided, provides armor-like defensive support, but vulnerabilities may exist along the abdomen region where the skin is thinnest. What well, this creature lacks is speed, and speed is supplemented by forceful blows and impressive reach of long forearms. Very long. Mr. Long, 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 long fellow. It's my brother, it's my brother Jotes. We go bowling. Oh, there's a thing over there too. Oh, we know what, we can swim, can't we? Super dunk. I gotta fight two of these pieces of shit. Space goats coast to coast. Get in there, do. Yep, there you go. Yeah, get in there, get in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's nice. There was something in there. A swoop. The skin, the swoop. Sure. Mm -hmm. I wonder if there's anything other over here. <clears throat> Bada boom. You have so many champions at this point, it's almost impossible, impossible to mountain to climb. Just learning all the abilities, passives, traits, rolls, yeah. That's, that's the kind of shit that I could never get into. I could never. Big ba da -boom. <clears throat> Whoa, dude. There's a thing down there. BD? Trail. Trail, brah. Okay, there's a thing down there, so maybe we can dive at some point. You should not have come back. Zach, yes! Zach, thank you so very much for the 15 months. I do appreciate that, my friends. It's great to see you, brother. I am enjoying Star Wars. I am. So far, some pretty good. It's a little bit, it's a little bit linear, but uh, I, I absolutely love Star Wars universe, so I really, I really can't complain. Hey, BD, let's go. Hey, 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 hey. Not everything has to be, like, super open. Why? Thank you, Zach. It's great to see you. You should not have come back. Pro droid. They're watching us, BD. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Dunked. Ah, I see. Hmm. There's a thing over there. Uh, 
Okay, looks like we can just. Yeah, all right, that's that's that's. Looks like we can do that. The BD droid, yeah, I like to call him BD Wong. My favorite character from Law and Order: Special Victims Unit. Uh, Brontide, thank you very, very much for almost a year. One more month to go. I'm doing very good, Brontide. Thank you so much, dude. Thanks for coming on. Thanks for hitting the button. Something. Oh, Colin, yeah. Actually, I just rewatched uh, all three of the original movies. I just rewatched it, dude. Hoi. You know those, you know the movies, you know, there's there's movies out there where you can, you own them, you can watch them on streaming services, super easy, but you never do. But then when they're on TV, you watch them on TV and you wait through the commercials for the next <laughs> It's absolutely, it's crazy. That's what I did with Star Wars. That's what I did just recently with, with, all, the, with all the Star Wars. They were on TV. <laughs> oh, Mingarm, TV is very much a thing here in Australia still. It is very, very much a thing. I hadn't watched TV since, uh, I hadn't really sat down and watched TV since I was 19 years old until I came to Australia. There's just like really no reason to. Yeah, yeah. Only copies really out there are the retouch versions. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, I was watching, uh, what is it? It's episode four. It's a new hope where Han Solo walks around the backside of, of, of Jabba the Hutt and Jabba the Hutt's like animation, like pretends like he just stepped on his tail because that was just a dude. It was just like a guy in a fur coat before. I would like to see the originals again. How does T even V? <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to come original, bro. <laughs> Whoa. Amber is the color of your energy. Whoa. Shades of gold is played naturally. Need a job on the other. Our forces have inflicted heavy damage to the Separatist Dreadnought. Unfortunately, the same is true for our vessel. Despite the damage, I recommend we see this through, together. You know, I'm not one to back down from a fight. <clears throat> Beautiful disaster, Grim Sage. It's a, dude, 311 is pretty badass. They're pretty good, man. I got to see them live uh, when they came to Alashki, because their career was inevitably going to end soon. They were... They're, They've, that's Alaska. The bands is it, they go to Alaska when they're prepared to die. Sure. The final destination. <laughs> what is it? The the final frontier. So we were playing that game, that that game called Alaska that was made by this like this British guy. Some indie game, and he called. And he called it. It was like this really, really epic narration that he was that he was doing, and he called it. He called it the uh, the final frontier. <laughs> That's space. That's not. 
Alaska. That's space. Something stuck in my nose. Okay, there it goes. There it goes. I don't know what it was, but it's in my brain now. Oh my god! Can I get can I get him with one of these? I cannot. I cannot. That was a mistake. That's a mistake. Yeah, I should not have waited for the plunge attack because I think if they see you, you're not able to plunge them. Three level was from Nebraska. So you heard them a lot. It's nice. The void of space. It is pretty cold in Alaska. That's true. We get punished. We get punished with these long load times. You guys got to let me know if you get this on PC. Let me know how the how the load times are. It's like going from PS4 Monster Hunter World to PC. It's like oh, incredible. <clears throat> Shades of gold display naturally. You wanna know what brings me here? Oh! What's up, Crash? Good to see you, man. How you doing, brother? Hunter? Oh, yeah. We got that one, though, didn't we? Do we not hook this up? Do I have to do it again, maybe? Okay, it's saved. Yeah, it's saved it up. Have I heard of the Star Wars D Specialized Edition? Fan project working on restoring the original Star Wars movies to the original theatrical version. Really, Tempo? That is, that's like the ultimate. So, like, hipsters made it to media, basically. They broke, they've broken into big entertainment now. <laughs> that's awesome. Crow, this guy. It's, it's we don't roll quite fast enough, so maybe instead of doing our power attack, we just have to do one short, short attack. We're not fast enough to roll away from his three attacks. <clears throat> you have the originals. I have the originals on VHS somewhere. Uh, they they might be gone now. They were at my parents' house, but they they moved. <clears throat> They're probably long gone by now. He's probably miles away. Well, we've died twice on this boss. This is the hardest boss so far. <laughs> We're playing on a hard mode. It hasn't been too tough. People were saying this was like Dark Soulsy, but I was I was I guess I was kind of expecting it to be like pretty, pretty tough. Get this one. The villagers built this memorial to the clones and the Venator. If only they knew the truth. If only, dude. If only. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's quite a run, dude. We gotta go to the. LPD. I think we gotta go to the side. Of what's going on? We gotta go side sidestepping on this, bro. Yeah. Oh my God! Another. Five tier two subs gifted from Red Panda Bear. Thank you so very much, dude. Holy shit. Thank you so very much, man. Ah! Help, please. Help me. Thank you so very much, Red Panda Bear. You're too good to me, dude. Always too good. How the hell are you? Are you doing well? <laughs> Fucking A. Another step. <laughs> Great. Jesus. Got stuck on the wall. Tier twos, dude. Oh. Stuck on the goddamn wall, man. I think what we got to do is just we have to be full life on this guy. If you get stuck in that, if you get hit twice, it's toast. You're just fucking warm, buttery toast. Star Wars Dark Souls, Red Panda Bear, it's more like Star Wars Uncharted or Star Wars Tomb Raider. That's what it feels like to me. We are actually going after tombs as well. Darksiders, really? Yeah, I don't I don't really get that. This game has graphics. It's got graphics, man. The, ex the exploring and like doing the missions and, and basically like your objectives and stuff and the little puzzles, the puzzles especially, they've got a very uncharted or, or, or um, Tomb Raider feel. <clears throat> uh, the, the dodge backwards, that's what we tried the first two times we tried to fight them and that was not good. I think we just got to use this pillar here. Again. Jace. BD, here. Help, please. The double. Right there gets me, dude. Oh. I think we might need some more Estus. Space Estus. Uh, yeah, I've I've tried to 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 slow him down. I tried twice to slow to use my slow on him, but that that did nothing really. Can I parry? I guess we could. We could try. We we will probably die many many times in the process. Normally parrying in this, it just deflects. You can't really, um, you don't really get a lot of damage in on it. But I guess since he doesn't block, we might we might try that. I 
We do not have any tricks up our sleeve. The skill tree is pretty, pretty minimal. It's pretty, pretty small. Maybe if we change the color of our star of our lightsaber <laughs> sleeve, dude. Yeah, that could that could do it. Mm. This is the this is the punishment right here. <sighs> this load time, dude. It's fucking atrocious. The Main Street shirt is back. By the way, if you didn't know. This shirt right here. It's back in action, baby. For 14 days. God knows where it goes after the 14 days. We never, we, we didn't ask. Oh man, the blood, the bloodborne load, the bloodborne load times. Oh my god, when it first came out, <laughs> I totally forgot about that. I totally forgot about that, man. Holy shit, that is crazy. Oh, you look at that. It actually gave us the. Um, Okay, so there is no parrying. You can slightly block, but you can't parry him. Yeah. You can't parry him. You, you can just slightly block it. <clears throat> Prices go up and the size goes up for the shirt, Hellbent? I have no idea. Is that true? Is that true? I didn't think they did that. That'd be rough. Was as bad as pill. Does that mean if you if you get a smaller shirt, does the price go down? What if you get a teeny tiny little like a teeny little tiny doll like a doll sized shirt? <laughs> I don't know. I'll give this guy another go. Two XL is twenty six dollars. That's some bullshit. Oh, I I I don't know. I, I I I just get I just don't make the rules. I guess I just don't make the rules, man. That is a shame. I guess it makes sense because there's more material involved, but that would also mean that if you get a smaller size, then it should be cheaper. Yeah, we want we want extra small shirts to be like four dollars. <laughs> Zeno, you son of a gun, you rascal! All right, we're gonna just, we're just gonna go uh, with the um, original plan here. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to to give him the old the old one too. See if he sees me when he comes around. Don't you look at me. I saw that I saw the thing where we could we could jump down and give him the old one too. The old the old plunge attack, so let's see if we can the old razzle dazzle. Let's see if we can do that. I'm glad this guy's pretty tough. There hasn't been like a super tough guy. Yeah! The Razzle Dazzle! Really didn't do as much damage as I was hoping. You gotta get out of there. Started off real early. That's what that's it right there. Whoa! Draw stim. The stim. I can't. I gotta read it. I gotta read it. Oh, 
Trust me, what BD? I'm just gonna get one of those in me, buddy. What are you saying? You gotta bait it out. You gotta bait those attacks out, man. That's that's the key. Hey. You don't want that super the, the super three swing where he does like the big wide one. That's the one that you want right there. Whoa! That's I'm pushing square. <laughs> he said I was doing. That's what square is. I was doing square. Okay. I guess you have to. And then square. There should be a picture of somebody going. And then square. I think that's pretty much what you gotta do. Hold. And then square. No, no, you don't. You don't have to hold it. So. It's just you just push square. But you you have to you've got to like make sure that you're not pressing it a bunch. I guess. It doesn't say press square a bunch. It just says push it. Okay. This looks terrible. Can I run along the wall here? No. <laughs> That's... It's only blue if you're not standing up. Okay. Gingerly now. Hey! What is it? What is it, BD Wong? You got this thing? Get it, buddy. BD Wong, he's on the scent. He's on the trail. He's on the scent. You can switch between uh, single and double, yeah. It's like a stance, yeah, because the move the move sets are different, and so are your uh, your skills. Satisfying. <clears throat> BD, this could use some power. Hey, what the heck? Just wait a second. the hell was that? I thought it was ice. I thought it was ice for a second. Okay. Things are going well, aren't they? Could you stay over there? 
BD. Just stay over there. We can we can avoid this entire puzzle if you just stay over there for like one freaking second. That thing, what the, what is that thing even for? Something I'm not seeing here. BD, stay there. <laughs> that was <inside. laughs> Stay there. Okay, you stay there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be, I'll be over here. Hit it, BD. Let's go, BD. No, let's not go. You have this little time on the door? Wait, really? I don't think you... I don't think you can. It's only things that are flashing blue, which is this. Which I'm not sure... What that is. What is that? What is that even for? What's the spinning thing even for? I wonder. Thanks, BD. Thanks a lot, butthole. I'm blowing this. This thing needs your overcharge. It runs, yeah, it runs, it runs, it runs fine, yeah. Okay, so if, if I hold this thing into place and shut it off, no, it's, it's, it doesn't, it doesn't do its thing. Big dick energy. Things are going well, aren't they? I don't think we can use that thing to cross the water. That's the thing. Come in with the milk. What's behind the spinner? I don't know. I guess we'll we'll go we'll go explore that some more, huh? Think we're doing okay, BD? No, we're not, Cal. Shut the hell up. Do the thing. Good. I don't think there's anything behind that. I don't think so, anyway. You can slow it for some reason. I don't think there's there there is not anything behind this. How far are we? We're eight hours in the game. Eight hours. It's it's going good. Uh, just get fading. It's, it's going quite good indeed. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck this is all about. Can you dive? Uh, I'm thinking that you could probably dive at some point, but you can't dive right now. We don't have the, the, the ability to do so. I feel like I'm just missing something here. I really don't see any, any... Check the ceiling. There's a hole in the ceiling. I'm pretty sure where... I feel like we're just missing something here, man. We gotta be missing something. There is this over here, which we haven't gone into or something. Oh no, that's, that's the door that we're trying to get to. I'm trying to get over there. Does anybody does anybody see how to do this thing? Because I, I really I really don't see anything here. Think you can help me, BD? You can free you can you can slow down time there. Um 
The door is open when you electrocute, yes, but our mission right now is to get across. You cannot leave BD there, no. The hole in the spinning matter is some, for some reason. Yeah. It's for something. Can I jump on top of this thing when when it's when it's doing it's 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 at a very very strange angle, isn't it? Yeah. I think so. No, I did. I didn't cross earlier with with BD still here. I didn't. No. I did not. BD, toss me stem. Just in time. I go over. And I try to. Hey, BD. Right, right, right when he, right when he hops up, he just, he just instantly tells BD to come to hang out with him. Which is, which is, it's his fault, not mine. Oh, there's a, yeah, okay, nice. Hey, I got so used to all this, like, all these vacuum tubes hanging everywhere. Nice. Good thinking. Galaxy Geek, what's up? Nicely done. Well done, guys. I got so I got so used to all these like vacuum tubes. So there really wasn't any reason for this spinning thing and being able to slow it down. That's where they're trying to uh That's where they're trying to confuse you. The spinning thing isn't for anything. Tricky. It's a red herring. It's a it's a it's a red haired herring. Like our like our protagonist. I'm fine, Commander. Where, where is Mosef? Where is my Padawan? Because I, I spent like the first five hours of this game just trying to chop everything. And, and I couldn't chop anything. So I just kind of stopped doing it. Transmission now. Probably the squad. Uh, hang on. It's from the Supreme Chancellor. Chancellor. The Supreme Chancellor. Let's go, BD. Hey! Oh wait, this is... That's, that's where we already went out that way before. Do I need to do anything else here? Unexplored! Okay, there's some sort of unexplored thing over there now. Oh! That thing's probably open now. Well, we, I mean, we looked. We looked to see if there was anything back there. I didn't see anything. If there is, it's probably underwater to, like, come back and dive. Yeah, it was just fucking with me, man. This is unexplored territory. See him? Empire isn't the only thing we have to worry about. What are you talking about? Goddamn dog hair. Them de divide uh, online no Jedi suddenly. diving courses. What could have caused such a thing? Could have caused such a thing. A sudden disaster struck, killing the creatures in this tunnel with a massive flood. Throffy, what's going on, man? Something smells like old oil. Sorry, buddy, not you. It's this water. Hey, look at that. Aha! Skills. <laughs> Powerful strike that is deadly against weaker enemies. What about this? So holding push, I don't really do a lot of pushing. I should really start doing that. Airborne attack that allows Cal to push away nearby enemies. Triangle. Use the triangle, Luke. 
waiting longer, press attack, Cal swings his lightsaber, allows him to perform a special attack. And that is like the Right. Well, that might be kinda cool, I guess. Sure. Delicious. Absolute decadence. Oh. God. Very nice. Nice, nicely done, buddy. Imperial excavation equipment. The level of dust suggests it's been sitting here for a long time in a galaxy far, far away. Going down, butthole. <laughs> Guess he doesn't see me. Speed up your movements while slowing everything else for a short time. Yeah, that will be cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a lot. That's a, a fairly. Oh, it, it's the. Of course, the wall run. Of course, my horse, dude. It's the, god, it's the goddamn wall run. Stealth takedowns would be way cool, yeah. Oh, did I want to do that yet? Kind of wanted to explore. Can we take this thing back down. punished here, didn't we? Oh, this might just be like a shortcut. Is there a backstab? No, there's a plunge attack, but, but if, if, they, if they're unaware of your presence, but you have to come from above. Yeah. Head back down. And go. This is a one-way trip, apparently. <laughs> Can I not <laughs> just fucking go back down? Come on! Great. Jedi. Get him! Keep dodging, I'm not giving up. He's not giving up. No matter what. There's, there's quite a bit of sliding in this. It reminds me of Ratchet and Clank on the rails. 
or 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 Jack and Daxter. Whoa. Surprise! Thanks for waiting, buddy. I appreciate that. Have a, uh, I've got attacks after parries, which totally fucking sucks. Help, please. attention. There we go. One more. BD, Stim. Stimskis. These guys are hard. That uh, counterattack after a parry sucks. Want to look inside? Huh. There's something in there. Pyramid Pug, what's up, dudes? Ooh. Mm hmm. What do you got? Oh, the lightsaber material. Got it. Excellent find. Oh, it will need delicious. My evaluation. Excellent find. Oh, God. Oops. Where the hell are we? Uh, we already took that one up. We got to take. Um, no, that goes back to the ship. Near the crashed Venator? Venator? Is it up here? Oh, it's up there. Okay. So we do have, we have to go up this way, maybe? I don't even know if that shit's connected, bro. That one's already up there. Goes back to the ship. So, these elevators don't really lead us anywhere that we want to go. The one that we already... Oh my god. Where are we going? Duel. Well... <clears throat> Let's get this one. Mm, Final Fantasy VII Remake is three parts only... Midgard next year. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> They're really going to stretch that out, huh? Oh. Gotcha. Staggers. Okay, cool. So I'm going to rest here, and I think uh, it's been eight and a half hours. I think that's probably going to do it for us tonight. We'll come back tomorrow. We're going we're gonna to play some, uh, probably some of this, and also some Death Stranding. We're also going to be playing a, a MMO for a couple of hours called Kingdom Under Fire. So... Um, yeah, that's, it's going to be a full day. It's going to be a big day tomorrow. We've got a big day coming. We've got a big, big day. So hit the follow button if you haven't already, guys. Thank you so much for joining me playing this game. I'm sure there's plenty of people playing this game right now that you could go over to. I do appreciate all of the support, all of the subs, 
You guys are crazy. You know who you are, and I know who you are. Thank you so very much. Don't forget, 14 days. This is the first day of the of the new campaign. Mean Streets, baby. I'll be tweeting about it. Follow me on Twitter, at Alaskan Savage TV. Oh! Tomorrow, we're going to be starting at our normal start time. Today, we started very early because of this game. Uh, we're going to be starting at 9 p.m. Pacific, so please do come back and hang out with us again. Thank you so very much, guys. But up, 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 but up. The support, greatest journey, Meth, Colonel Strachan. Thank you so much. Six foot five. What do you get? Another day older, deeper in debt. Uh, Craig's Macton, thank you so much. Throffy, I'm so sorry that you just got here. I know I started early. Normally I start uh, much later than when I started tonight, but we'll be starting at the normal time, 9 p.m. Pacific. Make sure you know. Colonel Strike, and we'll see you later. The Loon, YouTube, thank you. Black Wolf, A Greens, thanks for hanging out. Tempo, Jesta, Felix, Haz. I'm going to see you guys next time. Thank you so very much, guys, for all of the support. Go have yourself some fun. I'm going to make some dinner for Sarah, and uh, I'll see you guys uh, next time. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Pyramid Pug, bye.